First time ever. Oh, I got to speak into the microphone. Theo, can you hear me? <clears throat> yeah, I can. All right. Everyone good? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's do it. Tell me something, man. Stop! Because I have fucking framework. Are you happy in this modern world? <laughs> fireball. We're doing fireball because we're fucking badass. <laughs> you guys want to start off with a fireball? I mean, we can, yeah. We can start off with a fireball. Oh, hell no. I knew you didn't. I mean, he got lunchables over there, so I don't know. We can't. Bro, you should. <laughs> yeah, man. Yeah, love, welcome to Ooh. Love and then what? Fireball feels like what? college. Welcome, lovers and friends. It's me, your boy, Mr. Everybody. And I am joined today by the Central. Excuse me, the fireball came back fast. It definitely <laughs> The central sadist, <laughs> dominant, and creator of Pizza Important, Sir Lises, and Ms. Damn. Harley C. Quinn. How you forget me? Did you oh, I didn't say Theo's name. And you didn't take a shot either. Theo is so offended. <laughs> it was, yeah, how you it was a motherfucking Listen, show? Hold on, let me get past the guest. And Ms. Harley Quinn, kick educator, and class facilitator, and my co host. Nah, man, fuck the. <laughs> I, I, I really feel like it's because fucker. you drink it a salsa. I'm uh, drinking a seltzer. I ain't drinking shit. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? I came here drinking like, I'm drinking a seltzer. Real, oh, shit. I don't even have my hat on. People are seeing me without my clothes on right now. This is crazy. No, no, no. So, is it okay to just call you Harley just for quick? Yes. Okay, good. I wanted to make sure that I, I did that right. Harley, what were you like as a kid growing up? Perfect. Like, <laughs> were you straight like student. straight A's? Straight Perfect. A student. Went to private school. Damn near all my life. Uh... <laughs> Did ballet for about 10 to 12 years. Was a Girl Scout. Um, Girl Scout. Yeah, I was Girl. a Girl Scout. Sold the cookies. The cookies? Mm -hmm. Like edible, like real cookie cookies? Like I pimped cookies? the Girl Scout cookies. Yeah. Did you steal any of the Girl Scout cookies? No. You're under oath. Did a Girl no. Scout ever take your cookies? Yeah. I'm just did, did you? <laughs> did the Girl Scouts and the Boy Scouts ever flirt? <laughs> um, we never seen the Boy Scouts. So. Yeah, no, yeah, nobody ever sees them. What the fuck do they have, yeah, right? We've never seen them. They separate them on purpose. <laughs> <laughs> they're out there getting touched in the woods by the teachers. No oh, cross shit. <laughs> they're getting wild. All right, Lizus, what about you? What were you like as a kid? I was an athlete. It was basketball. That's it. Basketball. Mm. Walking to the park. Basketball. Non-stop basketball. That's it. Are you guys both from Philadelphia originally? <laughs> I'm actually from Norristown. Okay. Yes. Yeah. From Philadelphia. Okay. Did you play sports? Uh, I did track and field. I ran in the pen relays about three years in a row. Do you mind moving the microphone just a little closer? Oh, just okay. you can move it all the way to the edge, or you can put it on your lap, whatever makes you feel comfortable. No, no, let's get right here. Let's get right here. <laughs> or use your up. big girl voice. Oh, use my big girl voice. Okay, so um, I ran track and field. I did the pen relays about three years in a row in middle school. So yeah, I was kind of busy all my childhood. <laughs> so when did you guys lose your virginity? Damn, Man, I just too. told this story. Ooh. Sixth grade, the summer going into seventh. Sixth grade? Sixth grade. The How old is that? Like, a, like 12. 12, 11. That's probably when Theo lost his because yeah. he was able to say it so 13, fast. 13, 13. Relax. But so the, the crazy story is like it would have happened sooner, but I had no talent, no skill. I had no idea where to put it at. <laughs> so I was missing <laughs> yeah. the first couple of times. And my excuse was it wouldn't fit. <laughs> like <laughs> I feel like my dick kind of got hard at that age. Listen, my dick was getting hard from like birth. Like I don't remember. Do you really remember that? <laughs> I came out. My mom was like, "What? How? How did you first start jerking off? When I first, you know, you don't really know what you're doing at first. I used to like spit on my hand and just like rub my dick, and I was like, that feels good. And I would just do that for a while. I just, I just like do that. I was, I was straight to the lotion. I found the, uh, I found the cassette. Um, VHS, VHS, right? Yeah. And it was a gangbang. My first porn was a gangbang. Oh Jesus! And. I would wait, oh, wake up you. real late, going downstairs, and because that was only it was only one. Uh, what is what was VCR. it called? VCR. Damn, I'm, mm. geez, I forget what it's called. One VCR in the house. So everybody go to sleep. I would wake up like during the week, like two o'clock in the morning, go downstairs. I and I had to do a silent because I couldn't. Yeah, you, you know, jerk off. Nobody can hear. Yeah, so <laughs> I'm popping it in. I'm sitting there on the chair, whatever, and I'm waiting to make sure I don't hear nothing. And I'm going to work. Gang, so, gangsters yeah. go, moving silence, bro. Yeah, definitely do. <laughs> you didn't have a channel on your TV that was like squiggly lines. Listen, the porn I was in a no remote control house. You had to get up and turn everything. Who, play, <laughs> Whose cassette was, was no, this? 
I have no idea. It was in your house, though. It was in the house, though. And I found it in, like, a box of stuff, going through stuff, you know, just looking for Uh, You were just being newsy, man. Did you grow with your mother and father in the house? Uh, No. Just the mother? Just my mom. So it could have been hers? It could have been. Now that I think about it, oh, man. I'm not just going to say it's definitely hers, but it it more than likely somebody dropped it off. I'm the middle child, so I had an older brother and an older sister. It could have been one of theirs. Mm -hmm. You know. I found my pop stash. The stash. I found the stash. Not like finding the stash. And I, I always put it back after I was done, but I found that shit. Yeah. <laughs> they knew you was watching it. Yeah, I don't fuck. Then, then I don't you gotta fuck. put it back perfectly yeah, so they don't know yeah. that you took it. <laughs> a couple times they're so good, they just threw them bitches back in there. <laughs> fuck it. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I'm watching it, like, it. Where's my bush my, my bushy girls <laughs> video? <laughs> Big bushy back girls going wild. Butts. <laughs> So, Harley, don't think I'm just going to go past you and not ask you when you lost your virginity because you got quiet. You kind of turned away. You did that right there. See what you're doing now? You're doing it again. When did you lose your virginity? Um, 11, 12. 11 years old? Around 11 or 12. Who freaked y'all? See, this is... I feel like... See, this... I feel so weird that I'm not like everyone at this table anyway. I feel like I'm more normal than than you guys. More normal? It when it comes to my, my it sexual on the age. age that you say, because you say 28, it's like, yeah, we're looking at you like, Ooh. I lost mine at the ripe age. Of, no, uh, 18. <laughs> 18. After high school. So, after high school. Yeah, I wasn't having sex you in high school. You didn't have any bad influence for You weren't trying to have sex or you couldn't have sex? See, I was more, focus, I was more focused That's on really drinking. Okay. Oh, okay. I was like the party guy, if you can't tell from everything about me. I was like, besides the truly, don't. Should be a sponsor. Don't judge me off of trulys. I'm trying to lose weight. I've lost <laughs> a bunch of weight. I think it was still as. Gaining weight, it's not a big deal. Nobody cares. And, but it is very noticeable to people at home, and it is hurting their feelings. But I'm sorry, go on. How did you lose your virginity? <laughs> you fat fuck. <laughs> <laughs> um, <laughs> <It's bull. laughs> uh, so I lost my virginity to my babysitter. <laughs> Wait a minute. Guy or girl? Minute. <laughs> to a guy. How old was he? Why would you have a guy babysitter? I was some things in life are just better left not explained. Now, we need to explain. So how you know, how old was he? For me, um, at the time, I really don't remember how old he was. Uh, oh come on! Don't want to get him. You don't want to get, go to jail. I feel you. No, I he feel was you. under eighteen. He, is watching he was right under eighteen. Now. So he was in high school. He lived across the street from me. Oh Jesus! And he used to babysit me because my mom used to work late. So so, at, so after he took your virginity, how long did that go on? For like eight years. <laughs> eight years. That was like my Sheesh. boyfriend, my unofficial boyfriend. We used to go on dates and everything. Well, he was on like the stage to the to corner take me store out. to get kids. He was oh, like to the movies, <laughs> like to home? dinner at eleven. He like, going skate, so man. I'm guessing your mom was paying him to watch you, correct? I don't Damn, really he know was paying a hit. I, I was gonna say, so he was getting paid to have sex with you, yeah? I don't know if she was paying him. I don't know if she was just making sure he had dinner. I don't mm. really remember all those details. I was. I think you would have been cool with. So you were being wined and dined at eleven. I was being wined and dined at eleven. That's why I have this lady that are forty. I was going to say your expectations got to be very high crazy. Expectations for very my partners, high. yes. So, I like okay. vanilla time. One time for the baby. We need to take a shot to this baby. Set. Oh, we need more <laughs> shots. <laughs> oh, I need to get Chris to get a shot in here. Damn it, it's too far now. I'll take a shot. Take a shot for the baby. Yeah, y'all can take a sip of y'all. Uh, <sighs> Should have got more shots. So I ain't even so open so that so shit so yet. <laughs> Where's? I don't know where I found this. Yeah, anyway, so, so. so you fake took a shot at the beginning? I never took. I nah, never fake this shit. Yeah, you know what I mean, I ain't doing anything. He's yeah. scared. Well, I got you now, he though. Was, he He's was, scared. Wait until later. He was eating a lunchable. Wait until later. He take a shot. He when we get, we got a table of fun out there. He had the hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's let's get some straight. Uh huh. Let's go. This is chicken and a biscuit. <laughs> Should be a sponsor. That chicken sounds like a motherfucking. Biscuit. Where did you get that? Is that at a <laughs> bodega in New York? At, at, no, at the fucking market. And I'm gonna take two. Oh my god, he's always got to eat. It's ridiculous. So, were you? What kind of porn do you guys watch now? Are you only getting off by BDSM? I don't even watch BDSM porn. I definitely don't watch BDSM yeah. porn. What do you guys get off with? Sheesh, I look at. I'm. A, I, I do some weird stuff. Like I'm. I'm. I'm a scroller. So you know. Whatever catch my attention, but um, I like sloppy, nasty head. Yeah, I want to hear it. it. Give me a thirty seconds of the girl looking like she just everything everywhere type stuff. I yeah. want to hear it. I want to see it dripping down your chin. Your eyeballs is red. You crying, all that stuff. I want all that extra shit. I don't even need to see the penetration. I just need to see you. I only care if it's, you got a fake. Deal, you know what I mean? Just mm-hmm. I need to see the girl doing that. That's it. That does it for me. So do you do you still get so if you get head now 
Do you get off by that? None, listen, none of my head that I get is like none of the stuff that I see. It, I don't even understand how they even do that. Like who even set me up for this type of failure for me to see that? And I'm like, <laughs> see, I didn't come from anything. I'm sending videos like, hey, can you do this? And she's like, sure. And I'm like, this is not this. <laughs> like my expectations, yeah. are, I, they have not been met. I mean, I've, like the I've, got good, I've got good oral. I mean, I've got amazing oral, but it's never like the, the porn that I go search to see. It's not like that. So, I'm like, so it's like the barbershop picture. Like, give me that cut. You know, damn well. Yeah, really and it's going to be cool. Uh, yeah. It's good it enough to go cool. out. Let's yeah. go bag a couple. But it's <laughs> not. It ain't the picture of the thing. Like, bro, that's not the eight. <laughs> it's like me walking in it's with like a picture 7. of Brad Pitt 9. when I was 12 years old and I had hair. I was like, make me look like Brad Pitt. He said, I can do whatever you want to your hair, but you'll never look like Brad Pitt. <laughs> but if you take the time to dedicate yourself to, you know, working on your head, you know. You can move to my top five head <laughs> <laughs> situations. What about you, Harley? I watch tentacle porn. Tentacle? Yeah, like non-related. What, what does this mean? I, so, yeah, I don't even know. <laughs> so it's not exactly Sounds like boring. humans. What? It, animals? Wait, 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 animals? I mean, they be human, but they have tentacles and stuff. All right. Are you talking like, about like... <laughs> Like octopus tentacles. Yeah, like yeah I got porn. that. Like the but shit that be on the ads. Like cartoon porn. Like not necessarily cartoon. Oh, are you sure. fucking real? Wait, wait. Are you into bestiality? No, it's not You're, animals. Stop dancing it's around. People, an octopus aliens, is an animal. But no, but they have tentacles. So they, they dress like tentacles. an alien. No, they are they like, deformed? Like people, like yeah. nice and they got little shit just hanging out. These all right, so they're not cartoons, shit. but they're people that are octopuses. And it's and they got what are you talking about? So Lizus, what is I this? Mean, you gave her the liquor. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> no. yeah. I didn't even drink the Fireball liquor. has done I it did. again. Yes. No, I, yes. I'm, I don't. I mean, and if I'm watching, like, but you're not explaining what this is. Cause we really tentacles, so they like get fucked with the tentacles. Okay, but are these people? Is it real people? Live action? Live fun. people. Well, you can't be a real person. People don't have tentacles. They like. Just 3D characters. Oh, so, it so it's cartoons. Oh, uh, she is. Oh watching, my god. She's watching the cart. You know how when you watching it's porn and they give you the ads. I can like they can make you come in 30 seconds. That's the type. Of if shit I would have judged her anime off of the porn that she watched yeah, based right. off her Basically. shirt, I would have called it anime. Yeah, anime. facts. You like, you like anime porn? Nope, I don't watch anime oh god, porn. It's the same thing. No, it's not the same thing. It's a whole different category. Okay. So How long does it take you to get off in this octopus porn, octopusy, whatever it's called? Octopusy. I like octopusy. that. I mean, octopusy. am I using just a wine? However you do it. This is your I'm Friday night. You're like five minutes or so. Five minutes? Yeah. That's too long. That's not too long. How long does it take you, Lise? 30 seconds. No. 30 se you can go from hard to soft in 30 seconds? Well, first I'm scrolling. The, the time to get to what you the, the right one, right. you're already there. Mm -hmm. When you find it, you I don't. And I dropped the phone, so I'm not even looking. Like, I'm oh. trying to still see it. Mm -hmm. I hate that when you, like, you're just, you're, you're, you're slow stroking, yeah. no. trying to find the right scene to jerk off to. Because I can't, because I got to, as soon as I get it, I'm like, I got it. And I got to go right in. You, you know what I mean? There's no hesitation. You got to hit the right angle. Yeah, but if I need to scroll and... through, I got to keep touching it. And I don't want to touch it with lotion. Like, you know what I mean? Lotion's on your phone. I got to keep. Wiping the phone off and stuff. No, it's not. And I don't like to put it on my actual TV because, you know, nowadays everybody only has apps. So I don't, yeah. you know, I got to. get Chromecast to your TV. I, I Chromecast don't even know. All my TV. Yeah, I need to do that. You must live you alone. Do you live alone? <laughs> I have a child. <laughs> Poor kid. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. Does she, she know like these that. things? No, she doesn't. Okay. And, and, my, and rope is like in my house regardless. So it's nothing new. Like she's just like, uh, you got rope? Think rope sitting here. Mm. Can you please wrap this <laughs> How old is she? 13. Oh, you got oh come on. Too. Yeah. She's going to know. Until you come in and she's tying somebody out. Like, mom, look. <laughs> <laughs> There's a little boy sitting there like. So, so, how did, so how did you guys get into this? How do you different. How do you go from being a track star or a baseball player to going, I'm going to smack, spank, and I don't, would you say torture somebody? I don't know what you would call it. Mm, torture. So I started off as a swinger. Um, about 17 years ago. So I got introduced to the lifestyle as a whole in, in the swinger aspect as an exhibitionist. Mm -hmm. So my ex, she liked to be seen. Um, we would, you know, typical, you do stuff like you drive and you get hit in the car. That's basic exhibition stuff. Or maybe in a restaurant bathroom or on a balcony and vacation and stuff mm -hmm. like that. But then you keep wanting to chase a bigger high mm -hmm. and do different stuff, different places. So it went from head in the car to fucking in front of 300 people. 
You see what I'm saying? At a swingers club or at like a resort, you know what I mean? Damn. That's see, I, me and my girl. Show. Damn, I don't that's need it. I don't think I could, I don't want anyone to see my penis. So that's something I don't want. I, I will walk through the party. Bah, bah, bah. Excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. Well, I, you're eight feet tall. So I'm assuming that. Oh, man. <laughs> you don't have to worry. Yeah, I don't. Even know. on a cold night, you're bigger than 95% <laughs> of the men in the world. I mean, I'm not comfortable talking about my penis with another man. But for the people that will be watching this, yeah, yeah it's, you know. It's, it's a, yeah, it's a nice size. It's a nice size. <laughs> and if you buy your ticket, the piece and porn has on your ticket. And so I did say I did put that out there. I did put I will I will yeah, send it to you. He, and I, I was giving discounts out. If you buy a ticket, you buy a ticket, ticket and porn I will, on Thursday, he will send you a dick pic. I will pic. send you a dick pic. <laughs> well, Jesus. I'll put it in a hot so, dog. So you bought some tickets. Wait, well, you? Pl- I work there. That's what I was about to Do you say. know what his My dick fault. looks like? My fault. I'm pretty sure I do. He likes to walk around with it out. All the, I really think I have a video of it out at breakfast one day randomly. Wait, wait. what? <laughs> what? <laughs> there so, your sausage and your sausage just hanging out. The bro? story was they were like, "What's for breakfast?" And I woke up and I went to the table and I poured orange juice on my dick and I said, "Dick, that's what's for breakfast." And, that's exactly what and all happened. the girls are sitting there and they're like, "Really?" And I'm just pouring orange juice on my dick as it hits the table. <laughs> the, were you hard this time or soft? I don't know. It was enough to, to to balance the orange juice and let it fall into a cup. So, did anything <laughs> did anything come from this orange juice incident with your dick? Yeah. No, 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 no. Did every girl? We were so we, wasted. We, I was we drunk. Were, it was like seven in the morning. Was I was still, still drunk. drunk. <laughs> and they're like, "What's for breakfast?" I'm like, "Dick." <laughs> and I'm just pouring <laughs> orange juice on on my dick on the tables. That's an epic story. We were in Tampa. We we're we did a, I did a I did a show in Tampa yeah. demonstration in Tampa, and my lovely beautiful friends came down to support and actually encouraged a lot of the fuckery. So we did the thing, but we had an Airbnb, and it was just, what me and her somewhere, we always encourage, because she do exactly what I do, but she's like me, but times 10, but she doesn't show it, because she has this little innocent look like, no, I don't want to do nothing, just come walk with me here. At least you know me, I'm choking you from the beginning. She's like, just walk with me here, I just want to talk about taxes. You know, (laughs) pop, 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 you on the ground. Like, I seen the guy that she had, and... He's talking. She's like, "Have you ever been here before?" I turn around. He's sprawled up, tied up to the to the to the to the freaking wall, and she has a whip. She's just wait, 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 and then she, might been floggers. I don't. She might floggers. Floggers. Yeah. I feel like you'd be the so, worst one night stand ever. Like I wouldn't expect anything from you. Like you know, it'd be fun if we just did this. Like I'll tie you up, and then you just start beating the shit out yeah, of me. Like, wait, 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 what happened? I'm jamming her after as well. You, I, listen, uh, you might have to. You can't. You would never expect it, right? There's so, no way you can you can plan for this, right? Here's here. the thing. No way you can't plan for. I it. have dimples and freckles and I'm sweet and innocent. It is what it is. I get consent beforehand. Hey, you want to try this? Here, let me just try this. It's okay if it doesn't hurt. We gotta, if it hurt, we ain't got to do it again. I'm going to give you all a word of advice. We ain't got to do it again. She come out with these titties and she put a little skirt on and she got a different wigs and she say, can I do what I want to you? <laughs> You're thinking, yes, I'm about to get sucked off. I'm about to be all. She's thinking, yeah, I'm about to electrocute the shit out of this motherfucker and tie him up and torture his nipples. You ain't even on the same page, bro. Nipples. It's levels to this shit. I lick nipples and blow um, air on them. Chin. Yeah. Blow air on nipples? I'm cool with licking, but why would you want to blow air on them? I mean, if she you're like a- 100 degrees hot and I lick your nipple and blow on it, what's going to happen? What, do you have this guy in the oven? What's going on? I mean, I don't <laughs> know what happened to him beforehand. I just know I had him when I was licking his nipple and blowing air on it. <laughs> blowing air on the nipples is next level. I don't blow on nipples. So where did you get the, Where did, No, how did you get started into this? Um, so I had an ex-boyfriend. Actually, pause. Blame I your exes. Probably, <laughs> I've probably been in the BDSM since around the time I lost my virginity because choking has always been a thing for me when I've had sex. Like choking and spanking. and um, I've had handcuffs since I can remember. I had a, like, a canopy bag growing up, and I've always had four pair of handcuffs on that bed, and I don't know why. Handcuffs. Four on. pair of handcuffs every time? Yeah, like four Adam, pair. Adam. On, one Are they just always? They were just there, and I don't even remember how I got them. I don't, I just know that, like, since I was little, I've always had handcuffs. I can tell you that your neighbor probably had a lot to do with this, and he probably put them there. Yeah. We need to find this guy. I think no, if, no, I think no, if you no, weren't no, willing no, the first no, time, no, you no, might have no, been killed. We need to find this guy, and he needs to be accountable for his actions. <laughs> Held accountable. I mean, Held I felt account- like in, like, somewhere during COVID, we bumped into each other, and I was like, yo, I really feel like you was a bad influence to me. And he was like, but don't you get paid for it now? I'm like, you know what? Have a great life. <laughs> bad <laughs> Have a influence. great life. Oh, you let him off the hook with that one. <laughs> <laughs> That's, 
You yeah, really let him know. I'm not even going to check you. Thanks for the money. He said, thanks for the money. You're like the Kim Kardashian. So where did uh, where did pizza and porn come from? Like, how did you come up with the idea for pizza and porn? Um, so actually, it just started off as a sip and mingle. And I was um, with some uh, ladies, and they wanted to just do a regular night. They were like, we're just going to chill. Um, it's going to be like pajamas and stuff. And um, we're going to watch. Uh, we're going to put some porn on, and then we'll probably order some pizza. And I'm like, pizza and porn. Hmm. Pizza and porn. I'm like, pizza and motherfucking porn. That sounds like a thing. And then I, was, I wanted to keep going with it. So it was just the whole concept of bringing a whole bunch of people um, that, were inter- that were interested in kink. Mm-hmm. And what I did, and putting porn on, serving pizza, and then just letting them engage with everybody. Bringing a couple of people that were uh, prominent members in the Ken community, whether Swinger, BDSM, um, Polly, because I was adding that too. And it was just a sip and mingle. When it started, I wasn't doing any of the live demonstrations. It was literally just me pouring drinks and licking girls' mouths and then just talking about kink and just introducing people that have never been exposed to it to people that do it every day. Like, I'm a person, I actually live the lifestyle. Mm-hmm. You know, everything I do, all the friends, like, my actual friends that I, like, same tat, like, brothers, they're all married. I'm the only single one. So everybody I'm around is in a lifestyle in some type of way. So everything I do, even if I go to a regular bar, I'm with all lifestyle people. Everybody is into what I'm into. You know what I mean? So our conversations are crazy. We're, we're, we talk like this at fucking Applebee's. You know, not saying I go to Applebee's, but I'm just giving you an example. So at any time, anyone can have sex with at, anybody. Or, or we're inviting somebody out. And we, a lot of times, we'll find a random group of girls and they'll come out with us to a spot. Like, we're going here, come here, or come to the show, or, you know, come out. He's about to do this. And I'll show them pictures. They'll be like, oh shit. And then they'll come. You know what I mean? You're so, just showing pictures of your dick and then they follow you? Nah, not pictures of the dick. I show them pictures <laughs> of my craft. I mean, I might try showing her and come out. <laughs> they might like, yeah, it's like the uh, Pop Piper. <laughs> start following <laughs> it, might, it might be oh, that but. it might be that situation but um yeah so the pizza and porn just really started as a sip and mingle and the name was so catchy to me yeah the no, name, the name was is so catchy. catchy and it wasn't even really a name at first it was just the concept they said what they were gonna do and they said we're gonna eat pizza and watch porn and i'm like pizza and porn and i'm like let's make this into a lifestyle thing um and as it progressed People, I was spanking a little bit, a little bit here, and then people started, I said, you know what, I'm going to just do an actual demonstration. Mm-hmm. And I'm going to completely change the makeup of the pizza and porn. I'm going to do a live demonstration, and then I'm going to have do the, the I'm going to chill before, I had a sip and mingle before, and then I'm going to do the live demonstration. A lot of people have never seen it. You know what I mean? They're coming, they get spanked a little bit. I'm like, it's so much more than just the spanking. Mm-hmm. And especially how I do it, the interaction, and you get to see that, and then the light bulb may go up your head like, damn, I love that shit. Like, let me go, you know, like, like, um, let me go uh, educate myself about that. Let me go research it. Let me go ask him some questions about it. And that just took off and started flowing. And most of the people that come have never seen it before ever. Most of them have never even heard about BDSM. I can say 50 Shades of Grey, but oh, I know that. You say BDSM, they're like, what's that? So 95% of the people there have never, ever experienced it, seen it before. And they're just coming for the first time, like a kid in a candy store. Like, ooh, what are you doing? See, when I think of pizza, it almost... Brings up the opposite version of porn for me. I have to poop all the time, so if I eat cheese, I'm gonna be farting nonstop. Like I, I love food, I love sex, right? But the two do not work out together for me at all. Like if I'm eating pizza, probably not gonna have sex at night. I'll eat one piece, maybe, maybe a little bit of salad, you know. You know what? There's a perfect situation for you then. There's a kink for that. You want to you talking about that? scat play? You talking about me sh- yes, you eat pizza and you do scat play. Scat play. So I just come in there with like assless chaps on and I just start shitting everywhere. Oh my pizza. god! Yeah. Who's cleaning up after this? Shit. Do I have to clean this up? Man, no, the staff crazy. will clean it up, but you what should. Ew. Staff is going to clean the up. Are these guys cleaning up loads? Listen, your kink is your kink. What if are you cle- talking about? If you're cleaning up loads, this is a judgment-free zone today. If you like to, yeah, I ain't judging y'all, but y'all some nasty motherfuckers. Listen, if you like to shit on people. Hard limit over here. I don't like to shit on people. It just I'm Hard saying limit. if I were to eat pizza, shit's gonna like the exact opposite for sex for me. Tomato, Hard tomato, limit. same thing. I mean, <laughs> if somebody else gets off, I'll be shitting on them. I'll I'll shit on you. See, I know. Now wait, I have a girlfriend. Wait, I'm not you sure. Really you really a nasty person. <laughs> she'll, she'll kill me. So if your if your girlfriend asks you to shit on her, would you? No, no? I'm leaving. But this is your girlfriend though. But at some point, I have to be near her again, and I just shit on her. But you love her. Of course I do. But I'm not gonna. So you wouldn't do it for love. Yo, he crazy as shit. <laughs> All right. 
Shit on me if you love no, me. Baby. This is her kink. Shit on me if you love me. And you want to be with her. I mean, are you not going to do anything to please the person that you might uh, think that you can marry? If, if this is her kink and you're depriving her from the kink that really gets her going. Send her to Dubai. What do I have to her? do? <laughs> I'm going to shit on her while she's here. Not literally, though. Send you her to her. Dubai. Why, why Dubai? Because you get people get paid for that in Dubai. The Instagram models and all that. Y'all ain't read the book. Oh no! He'll well, there's show a you book about shit. Dubai and f- yes, it's poop called porn? the uh, the Dubai Porter Potty. How you know? I read it. Was there pictures? No, mm. no pictures. Mm. Yeah, it's actually a website, and people really get paid to go over there to like. You ever been to Dubai? All. People get no. paid for everything. I've been to Dubai. Never been to Dubai. People get paid for everything. So. I mean, but I'm not going as an escort either. So I'm trying. I mean, this you don't gotta go to Dubai to shit on somebody. You can go right down. To- this Listen, pick any block you have you been shit on? No, I've never. never. You have you ever shit on someone? It, I, I peed on yeah, someone, man, but I've never. I it. peed on someone, but I've never. Did like, you pee on like stand over I, top of her? I, I peed right in her mouth, like. Whoosh, like did you have a boner at the time? Did I what? Did you have a boner? Um, I'm trying to. Yeah, I think I did. I and then did, did you fuck her afterwards? I didn't fuck her afterwards. Did you kiss her? I didn't. I'm not kissing. I, I, I <laughs> I'm personally not kissing, not right after. But Wait, hold on. Now that we so on much. that, right? See, hold on. Now that see, we, it's now funny, right? They're like, no, <laughs> fuck no. <laughs> now that we on it, uh, I just having a conversation with somebody, and I said, if I bust in the chick mouth, I'm not kissing her right after. And it was so like, what's you, the time you, frame? Why? What is the time frame? Before if I bust in your again? mouth and you come back up here trying to kiss me right after, right after, right. like so still the in the time frame though? Nah, I'm good. How much time do you got to put between? <laughs> my bathroom. <laughs> so if she goes right after and rinses her mouth out and comes back, is she you good to tongue it out? Uh, yeah. So, so let's three. Let what about a breath. little? What about a little peck? Let me smell what your if breath. she drinks a truly right after? Oh no, it's a wrap. It's too much going on on the tongue right now. <laughs> what if you don't come? What if she sucks your dick and then? She oh gets no, I, I, I'll kiss. I'll kiss girl after you suck my dick. Just not if I bust in your mouth. I know a girl in college used to purposely keep it in her mouth just to. She tell me all the time. You because she say don't come in my mouth. Not me. But other people, and she was like, "I'll keep running my mouth and kiss them right after." Yeah, they, that's. Yeah, I heard so, that she was called like snowballing. Like she would like go that. to the bathroom. I heard it's called like snowballing or something. Snowballing. That's some wild so shit. If you eat pussy the snowball effect, and then you come up to kiss her. You want her to kiss you though, right? Listen, first off, yeah, no real shit. No, 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 no real shit. No, no real shit. No real shit. I'm with it. Like just like I said, vice versa. As long as I ain't busting, I'm gonna kiss you. But yeah, no, if you eat pussy. Me, shit. What, you want her to kiss you right after you done, right? So what about pussy that you Damn. come in? You're not eating it? No. Mm-mm. So you come in the pussy? How long after you come in the pussy? I ain't coming in no <laughs> pussies, man. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I ain't coming in so no pussies. you ain't pussies. never coming in the pussy? Yeah, I got a daughter. Like, <laughs> okay, so that's <laughs> yeah, what I So that, that pussy that you were coming in, you never ate that pussy? That was my girl. My That was my girlfriend at the time. So, so you ate that pussy, Yeah. Right? yeah so, my how, so you ate it after you came in it? Yeah, yeah, later on down the line. <laughs> like two minutes later? Like nah, for round nah, two? I don't know. Yeah, no, no. Nah, uh, see, you fucking me up. You got me thinking like Justin right here. Uh, you need explanations. We no, want to know, right? We're real shit. Like, like, scientists. We want to know. I honestly don't remember me like busting in there and just. Like, if I'm busting her, I'm not eating her pussy after. So, would you let a girl. I think we'd be done after. Would you let a girl squirt in your mouth? Like, if she going, are you going in or are you backing up? Yeah, I mean. Scoop, scuba Dave, scoop, scoop potato, scoop, scoop potato. I ain't diving in, but I'm there. You there? You I'm not there. moving I ain't out the way. In. You're not yeah, I'm, not the way di- I'm not like ah. Let's what about you? You know what I'm saying? Is it okay to ask if your girl's a squirter? That's not um, okay. I feel like that might be off limits that's for you. Personal, but I don't think I can answer that one. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, let's just say hypothetically. Uh huh. Are you diving in or are you moving out? Like, are you? I'm moving out of the way. Like, if I if I feel like it's about to come, I I normally would get on top. Uh, squ- you know, wait, what? What you mean, squirting? <laughs> like, if she's about to come, I would probably get well, on I'm top. Well, I'm talking, like, squirting, though. Get on top of the pussy? or Yeah, like, I was starting to have sex. Okay. And she's about to come? Yeah. All right, I get that. I don't want to get it in my mouth. Oh, no, so intensify the orgasm. Like, if you, if, you, if he's eating her out and she's about to come, then he puts the dick in and... Yeah. yeah. I try to finish off with that. Like, I, I start you off with the spaghetti, but then you with the meatball, right? <laughs> I like this guy. <laughs> 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 I like- <laughs> You ain't gonna get no over just the spaghetti. Spaghetti is disgusting. But this dude, I'm coming with the garlic bread. <laughs> <laughs> that's the that's the one that everybody wants, but they can never have because it's, you can only get one of those really because everyone only has like one garlic bread, right? 
mean, I mean, unless you're in the gang, man, you get multiple guns. Unless you grow up in your house and there's so <laughs> yeah, much. You, get, you, you grow up in multiple. Yo, uh, 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 you grow up in Olive Garden. Yo, what's the extra, difference between the three cement train? Butter. What's the difference between the three cement train? Um, are we talking like multiple females or multiple males? However, you look at it. What's the three, or 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 the perception of it? Or an orgy in a train? So no, a train. threesome in the train. No, so, no. When I say a threesome in the train, I mean like threesome. How we gonna look at a threesome as a male, two girls and a guy? No. That I'm I saying. I'm so. talking perception. I'm no. talking perception. Yeah, but that's vanilla. what I'm saying. Not, not, not in your lifestyle. Yeah. Not in your lifestyle. But how we will look at it is a threesome. Okay. It's two girls and a guy. Uh-huh. Where a train is two guys on one girl. Oh, that's, that's nah. But so that's what I'm saying. In, in a, a lifestyle, technically, would have to be say it's four or five of us, and it's her, and where I fuck, and then I go. You fuck, then you go. Mm-hmm. He fucks, then he goes. It's a trade. We're going. Why am I last? <laughs> why, why can't I go first? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You go first. It's like throwing I think a hot dog down the hallway. When I you feel go, like if, if we were, let's just say hypothetically. Okay, okay so you're, all right, hypothetically, go ahead. Hypothetically, if we were, say it's, it's all of us here and one more guy there, I feel like. You would like fall in love with the girl. We be sitting here waiting, like, come on, bro. Like, listen, what's up? Is it because I'm like, white? I'm gonna fall said, in love. She nah, said I mean, that. <laughs> she said that she can see a future with me. <laughs> you would be like tonguing her and, and kissing she and like making love. You not, like, and the like, rest of them come in. Oh, yeah, I, I, I make like, love. He'd be like yeah, the third yeah. one. He'd be like the third one. And We're be sitting here waiting to, to ravage her, and, and you're just like, tell me, tell me, tell me your secrets. What's your deepest fear? What's your deepest fear? What's your deepest fear? So, does your families know this side of you? My mom does. Oh, that's bad. What does she, what does she say? Like, My mom would be like, what you doing, beating ass? <laughs> I'd be like, what? How did she find out about it? I, I, my mom was like my best friend. So I tell my mom everything. My mom knows that I host gangbang parties, glory hole parties, that I, I'm in a BDSM. She knows all <laughs> she that Glory stuff. hole parties. Yeah, my you mom at the parties? knows. I, no. Never been to the parties? I've only been to she, gangbangs. Did you say glory hole parties? Glory hole parties. Jesus. So I, I hosted a party. I can't do it. <laughs> It's, Before our relationship, that was like my one thing so I've always wanted to try. And the I never name did. of it is Wet Mouth Wednesdays. So that was my, so Wet Mouth Wednesdays, pizza and porn, and then Fuck Me Fridays. Those are my, my, my go-to events that I continue. And it's like weekly shit? It's weekly shit. It's God Wednesday. Damn. Wet Mouth Wednesdays, mm-hmm. pizza and porn is uh, foreplay Thursdays, and then Fuck Me Fridays. Foreplay Thursdays. That, that sounds dope. That's what, that, that's what pizza days. and porn, but then no, no foreplay was really going on, so we kind of just kept it at the pizza and porn. So that's actually, pizza and porn is actually my most settled night, mm-hmm. to be honest. You know, because it's really like, it's, it's really kind of PG ish, you know what I mean? Because most of the stuff I can put on Instagram, I can't, I mean, it ain't PG ish. But. It's I mean, well, we, we, we compared to a girl getting gang banged by twenty guys, sure. that's a little PG. When right? when is what day of the week is that? That's Wait, all Fridays. <laughs> but I've been fo- I've been focusing on the BDSM for the past couple of months because I've been getting you know booked all over the place. So it's a lot to do that. You know what I mean? But that's a party that I was really popular for. Hey, the fuck me Fridays. The gang ring, gang ring. So the glory hole party, right? It's called- <laughs> <laughs> so the glory hole. So I had a I had a, a private swingers venue. Uh, in Maniac, okay, mm-hmm. you know the Maniac area. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So, I had about four glory holes. So there will be a girl on the other side of the glory hole, and the guys come to the party, drink at the bar, and you just walk up, Superman, pull your pants down, put your dick in the hole, and you know mm-hmm. the person on the other end is going to work. You can't see them; they can't see you. That's the. But whole it's a guaranteed girl, yeah. And my party's a guaranteed girl. Okay. You go somewhere else. That's why I wanted to make sure because I feel like there's always the what mm, what yes. could it be over So there? there's a place in Jersey that has a glory hole. And if you get on the text list, when there's somebody behind the hole, they'll send out a mass text. So everybody gets a text like the hole is active. You jump in your car. You drive there. Now, a spot like that, you don't know who's behind there. But that's the thrill to some people. That's their that's their part of their kink is feel not them. knowing who's on the other side. Till you feel a mustache, you go, "Whoa!" Oh, I'm 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 that's, that's, listen to each of them. Your, your kink is your kink, but that's the thrill to them not knowing. Some people only do it because they don't want to know. Because I would get people like, "Are you sure it's gonna be a girl?" I'm like, "Yeah." They were like, "Are you positive?" I'm like, "Well, is there a chance?" Listen, what? no, I'm telling you. It's, so now I'm I'm listening to you, and you want the. You want the mystery. You want it to be. Uh, you want the, uh, it to be a mystery. Yeah. If 
who's going to be behind there. And a lot of times that's the thrill to some people that actually seek out glory holes. Because there's people that only do glory holes, that they that they just want to do glory hole parties. Like my phone, I got a whole text list for that. And they blow my phone, one of my numbers up, like, oh, you, you do a glory, you're doing a glory, is there a glory hole there? You're going to have a glory hole? What's the next glory hole? And it's nonstop. Like, you literally, like, I'll have, like, 40 guys show up to a glory hole party. And some of them is like so adamant about no, it's not. It's, it's only a girl, right? Some people are like, are you sure? Is there a chance? Maybe because that's their 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 thrill is not knowing. Shout Sam, out to them. Theo, what if you not go there? Really. So you go there, right? You go to the glory hole party, you come, and when you get done coming here, bro, we not even here. play like this. Like, <laughs> Great dick, bro. We're tight, bro. <laughs> we're tight. Thanks yeah, for the dick. He's crazy, man. I'm, I'm Would not, you tell anybody afterwards? What a little. I'm not showing up. <laughs> You want to do a glory hole? Uh, I'm not showing up. Like, like my man, like my man just said, his joint he could guarantee is one woman. I'm not showing up to the glory hole. Number one, I don't think I'm going to the glory hole. I think I'm going. But number two, I think that because my man said, like, if I did try the glory hole, it would be at his establishment because he can let me know it's going to be all women. I'm not going to no glory hole where I don't know what it is. Whenever it could be a dog or some shit. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? I'm good. I, I'd rather know what I got going on. You know what I mean? But you, on the other hand. I, I have I am happily <laughs> in a relationship. Me, tell me about, what if you was in there and you He's felt the beard <laughs> on your shit? <laughs> no, you no, trying no. to reach through the glory <laughs> No, well, the, so the scenario I gave you was you already came and at the end the guy goes, thanks, bro. <laughs> so would I tell anybody? <laughs> thanks for the load. <laughs> I don't know. I think it would be so funny on the podcast. I don't know. Oh for my content. God. Wow. For content. I don't know if I would tell anybody. So you want to go to the glory hole party? I can't go to the glory hole party. Single me would have loved the glory. That he was like wants my, to go. He's just in a relationship. Invited, no, I would never bring my girl to that. Just to watch. I don't think I could. You just, said just do a walkthrough. No, she would never be. He said fuck in front of 300 people. If I'm not drunk, I don't think it ever happened. I couldn't have sex in front of people. Well, again, I've done I it, so it's hard people. to say that. But I, I have oh, had sex in front of people. Multiple times, but I was a little intoxicated. So when you look back on it, you're like, God damn, you a wild motherfucker. But sober me, y'all gonna be like, yo, he too laid back to do any of this shit. Harley, how'd your family, or does your family know what you do? So my dad just found out. Ooh, how long ago? Story. <laughs> last weekend. Go on. Last weekend. So last weekend I was at the Roots Picnic with Horrible Decisions, and I did a BDSM demo, an did, interactive demo on stage at the Roots Picnic. Did he know that you were going to the Roots Picnic? No. We, me and my dad are, we're not going to say we're estranged, but like we, we kind of just say good morning to each other. We talk about my daughter, you know, like, like I can count on how many times on one hand, how many times I've seen him in life. Like we, oh. we know each other. Mm -hmm. Okay. So we're not friends. But um, my That's dad follows horrible so decisions, <laughs> and he seen it on Instagram, and good morning, Miss Quinn. And I'm like, well, who the, who, who, okay. And then I'm like, well, how'd you see this? He was like, oh, I see you had fun at the Roots picnic. He was like, looks like you really know what you're doing with the rope. I'm like, oh, wait till the rest of them pictures get posted. <laughs> <laughs> And he's like, you know, I mean, he's supportive, though. He's like, you know, have fun, live life. But he, yeah, he literally just found out. So was it a horrible decision to do that? Or are you glad you did it? <laughs> I'm glad I did it. I'm glad I did it. He has questions now. He's like, you know, he wanted to know about the lifestyle before me. And he's going to have questions. And I'm just like, I don't have answers. I don't have answers. <laughs> Gotta have answers. Shit. Sorry, Chris. Can we have like a bunch of the, like all the oh, shots and then a bunch of the beers? And then can you check that front camera, please? Sorry. Shout out but, to Chris uh, with the shots. Chris coming in with shots. <laughs> so, yeah, so I think that uh, just found out. this would actually be better if those lights weren't on. No, we need the lights. Uh, with those lights as well? Yeah. Oh, it's so crazy in here. If we had, if we actually had all the lights, right now we only have the two. So if we had like all four. I think we can get away with it, but it's always better to have more lights because it looks like daylight. You want it as natural as possible, but yeah. But out there, there will be uh, some colored lights for the show later on. So What show later on? There's Depending on the show. Uh, he, listen, I was told that you were volunteering and she was getting busy. Listen. Who? Miss Quinn. Y'all want to look at me with a straight face and say that shit again? Miss <laughs> <laughs> Quinn. Miss Quinn's going to Miss Quinn's gonna whip his ass. I'll, I'll volunteer. Don't worry. Yeah, 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 I just I it. told her before the show I was like I need to poop tomorrow I need to poop tonight 
So when I sit down, I, I don't want to hurt. What kind of pizza? So oh my he God. He said no penetration. Huh? No penetration. Oh, no, no penetration. Yeah, I don't do penetration. Yeah, you look like Kinky a little bit. You know what I'm saying? With the bang over the glasses and shit. You look like, yeah, yeah, her. Oh, shit. So wait, does your mom know? Uh, she's no longer here. I'm sorry. Oh, I'm sorry. She did not know. She uh, knew about me studying rope and doing shibari, and she thought it was like rope art, and well, that's shibari. how we left it. It's so Japanese weird. To say, rope art. It's so weird to say studied rope. Oh, this guy. Thank you. Ooh, Got a that. bunch of things. So, did he put shots in there too? No, I need no shots. Yes, Chris. It yes, it is. Yes, it is. I, I'm sorry, Chris. I want to see if he gets the. Uh, how's that front camera look? Can you see the side camera on that front camera? Let's see. This one looks good. Good. Yeah, they all look pretty good. Thanks, man. Chris. Fucking hero. Yeah. That's the, that's there the goes my hero. Go. Watch him as he goes. There's beer in there, too. There's only one real beer if you don't want one of yourself. So. Yeah, yeah, give him the, give him the real beer. Effect. The real big guy. Do your thing, man. Always need the things. I'm actually going to be... Uh, yeah, I can't get too fucked up here today. <laughs> well, you're drinking that? truly. You're good. Can I have a shot, please? All it. shots around. Are you good doing? Hey, oh, are you gonna no, do one with this? Drink it. Do it. Do oh, oh finally the fireball. No, I, I really, I really drink too much, right? <laughs> but after here, you know what I'm saying? Uh, my man like manages a bar, so I hope you're there now. Can you move the uh, so box? So bar and I drink. No, that's what I'm saying. When you get there, it's like that. You know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah. The bartenders, I'm helping them out, so you help them out. What they do? Here. Yeah, you have them out here. So here. He, you're not drinking because you want to get really drunk later. Let's take a shot to that. I don't really want to get really drunk I later. Shot, bro. I, don't, I don't want to get really drunk later, but I'm not trying to leave here fucked up and then. Theo's you know, going like, to get really drunk later. I, is I, this like an intermission? No, we're. we're no, we, no, we I mean, go straight through. Did you edit this part out? We, we could, but I think it's funner to see what we actually do. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. All right. Mm. I'm on like 1%, so if y'all <clears> cut out, I know y'all been jumping in and out. <clears throat> It ain't really a prime time. So, can you guys have regular sex, or does it have to be crazy? I got nasty sex. Yo, so, listen, before you, because that question was using, I was thinking about that, right? Yeah. From when I knew you was coming on, and then, like, you volunteer from that night, you, period. It's like, yo, running into y'all now as a regular nigga would probably be the worst shit ever, because you <laughs> like, yeah, choker, you're like, that's all you got, nigga? Like, it's like, it'll be really crazy. But like, I date vanilla, so what is, like, I don't... So, but why, though? What do you mean, you, would you get So you could just turn them out? I don't turn people out. I really am just... I'm chill. You're like a hot lesbian. You just turn people... You turn girls I out. I mean, I'm bi. I have a girlfriend. Listen, <laughs> you said we a smack of ass if you hit it from the back. He's smacking asses with that. That's how what I'm saying, like, compete? how are you... Like, what is your, like... Like in order to bust a nut, do cool, you have man. to do something crazy or can you just do this? I would just have sex and bust a nut. For it's okay. me like, personally, I, I would rather have sex in front of people. So I don't I don't want to have sex in a bedroom sex is boring to me. I'll do it, but if I have the, the choice, I wanna be like, we're all in the living room playing Uno and I just pull my dick out and I'm fucking her face. Now, I could do that around them. They're not it's not even bothering them. You know what I mean? Y'all might be like, So you're having a game night see, and you're playing. See, 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 see. So <laughs> playing, I, so playing sorry. My homies is crazy. Like, like growing up, it's wild. Like, we had a lot of, like, so, <laughs> yeah, sure. origin so, type situations. Yeah. But so we'll see that. Like, we'll be playing a game and he'll be on the couch going ham. And if she got friend, it's going down. What part of Philly you from? The part that you ain't. Okay. Can I have a? Uh, okay. Is there a beer over there? I can have. Or Say, no, I'm from uh, I'm from Southwest. Uh, one of these. Okay. Yeah. Perfect. What, what part you, you from? Uptown. Yeah, I can see that. I can see that. Uptown. <laughs> Uptown. Yeah. So wait, yeah. what, gets uh, what gets you off the fastest? Uh, dick. Well, I understand, <laughs> but what kind of sex? I'm saying, like you. No, I mean, I, it's no type of rec any sex. It's sex, like penetration, some choking. I'm so choking, is it you on top? Is it like what kind of? Actually, yes, me on top. <laughs> you on top with a toy and then I don't getting choked. Need a toy. No toy? I don't need a toy. How fast can you get off of you on top? Probably about two minutes. <laughs> Do you have to look at the guy or you want to be turned around looking at his feet? Uh it doesn't really matter. Doesn't okay. really matter. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, Rob, I like testicle hurts. pain. That <laughs> shit you like to <laughs> like testicle pain, like the stomach. You want some girl to punch you in the balls? No, no, no. You can smack it a little bit or I'll tell her to suck it harder. Like my nuts harder, but you gotta beat the dick at the same time. 
Well, well, harder. Tell harder. Me. You need a lot. Harder. That's not a test. Mean, you need a lot. That's not a testicle pain. How hard is it's, like, it's, like, it's pain, but you usually feel the pain like at the bottom of your stomach. Yeah, I like that pain. That ah. turns me on. You know how you get hit in your nuts and your stomach starts to hurt? That shit gets my dick hard. So if a guy walked up and kicked you in the nuts. I'm no. Not at all. We're not not, not because that. it's a guy. Not just not if somebody so. walks up and kicks I'm beating knees you in the me. balls, do you suddenly get a boner? No, I'm not. not going to do it there. Because it's, it's a controlled environment for me. So I have to tell the person to do it. You can't just, the girl can't just come in and do it. Because I can't, I, if I'm It's gonna, not him telling yeah, you what to do. I got to tell you to do it. It's him telling you what to yeah, do. So I, I don't, I'll, never put my, I'll never put myself in a submissive state. Even if a girl's on top, I'm going to top, I'm going to top from the bottom. So. <laughs> you, have a, you haven't found the right dom. I've always been the more dominant Even person in my relationship, but my current no. relationship, I'm right the submissive. <laughs> don't listen. First of all, don't encourage this bullshit. <laughs> what type of dominant do you need in your life, Lisa? Any dom. All he needs is some ball pain and some uh, so probably butt play. I'm guessing. I'm telling the girl, so he ain't she, even deny that. Even <laughs> deny that shit. But you know how he's girls, a straight rider, <laughs> but you can't fuck with he. You know how a girls giving you play head, some booty play she goes with to the me? balls, and most people are like, oh no, he's up. When she's doing that, and I'm telling her harder, she's looking, I'm like, harder. And I'll keep going, I'm like, harder. I'll probably say it like 10 times, and then she's like, you sure? Like, I'm like, nah, harder, like that shit. And then after that, it gets me harder. Then I'm gonna fuck her face or something like that. I swear. I'm, I'm a face fucker. So is your blowjobs with teeth? Is that what you want? No, I don't, no, I don't like teeth at all. You want your shit straight, man? I like hand and- Braces. I like hand, I like the hair. I'm an audio person, so. I want you to hear yeah, no, I want to hear it. I want to hear it. Like, was that you that said that too? Are you? Yeah, yeah I like to hear that shit. Mm-hmm. I want to hear it. Yeah, he's the same way. I like, I like when you talk that sloppy fish yeah. shit. So when you yeah, make it all that you know noise, man. I love that shit. Yeah, that See, shit. I got a dog. If we make too much noise, he jumps on the bed, so we can't do that. <laughs> we make noise, but like if it gets too aggressive, like if she makes too much noise, <laughs> like that. <laughs> See how, I, I wanted to see how I she know, it just happened. I wanted to see how cool she was, and she just that might be a kink. Is his girl in a burp? Hey, we have episode. We have burp episodes where oh, me and her just get on here and burp. Yeah. Oh shit! Like bunch of burps. She like she can burp on command. I can only burp sometimes. She can burp. Her, her burps probably stink. Do you think? See, I think girls farts and burps stink, and guys are normally funny. What? No, you posted that <laughs> shit at a bull farting on a banana and he ate it. They, they were just on the show. We, I just interviewed yeah, them. I know you just did it. That was yeah. Like, yeah. Oh, my God. Farts, that was the farts. I think farts are the funniest thing you can do with your body. Yeah. What do you guys think is the funniest love, thing? Yeah. Love right. and then what? <laughs> love and then farts. Love and then what? Let me ask you all a question. They cut me off. Everybody here, before your girlfriend, if you laying in the bed with somebody, Y'all just fucked or you did whatever. Y'all sleeping, they fart. How you reacting? Does it stink? I, I fart all the time in the bed, I'm so that shit don't matter. If I just met her, she gotta go. If she farts in the bed? Better. Does it stink? Yeah. Is she asleep? Good, go fuck if, out. If she sleep, how you. I would just. I would make. I would lift her covers by her feet so okay, it gets go, out. Go. You yes. call an Uber and everything? Hey, hey. That's hey. ridiculous. Are you taking I think her it's home? It's time to go. You taking her home <laughs> or you call an Uber? We go wait on the couch. I'm like, bitch, I did you call. just fart? <laughs> it is a little wet. You gotta, you gotta make it like awkward and dramatic. <laughs> bitch, did you just fart? No, I don't like. I, I, I can't really fuck with farts, but I, I ain't mad. I ain't mad at you if did you do that. Just... I think farts are hilarious, but the smell—if it stinks—I don't. I, I'm not a fan of it, so I would open the fe- covers by her feet. Fart, fart under the cup. Open the covers. By, okay, let it out. So it lets it, like Ash will fart out. in bed, and then she just like lets it sit there, I and then bet. she starts laughing like, "Yo, I open bet. the fucking covers Stop by it. your feet." <laughs> Stop being Ash business out there. Man. <laughs> Leave Ash the fuck alone, man. <laughs> she, I mean, shit. People fart. So yes. when you're doing this demonstration on stage, you ever get hard? I have, but most of the time I don't because I'm not really turned on uh, by. I need more than that. That's 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 regular to me. You know what I mean? I need more than that. Now, if you're reacting a certain type of way, um, and I can see that your um, that that your reactions to this are taking you to a next level, and then you're you're building up your orgasm and all that, 
Um, I'm going to react to that. So you like audible. So is it when she's, if she's moaning when you're doing it, that you get hard? The moaning helps because um, I hate someone that tries to hold it in. And we, we talked about that. And I always tell somebody, a lot of people get nervous because they see a, the crowd and they don't, oh, I don't want to scream. I don't want to moan. I feel like I'm going to look, no, mm. let that shit the fuck out. Let that shit out. Shit. Yeah, you ever come so, from it? Have I? No, 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 no. Never. You ever had a girl come on stage? Yeah, I've had Multiple. a girl. Uh, yeah. I like how you know, she, she jumped in real fast. You must because they're out. looking at me like, because they got to mop it up during so. the middle of the, not not her, but yeah. the staff, has, they have to mop it up during the middle of the show. And they're like, lead, st- lead stop. <laughs> and they're like, you know what I mean? They're, ch- and they're throwing me rags and throwing me paper towels and I'm squirting, I'm back at it or whatever. So at the at the actual bush, it has happened several times to where a girl has Way squirted. Several. Huh? Way, yeah, more, than way several. more than several. So yeah, I, yeah, I, I can, and, and it's not all the time, but it happens. And then also like I, I'll do that intentionally. And they were like, you got to stop doing that to these girls. You got to stop making them squirt. Like, to me, it's like I, I teach people how to do it. So I'll give you like an 80% chance. Host the class. <laughs> so what about you? Um, Have you ever came while you were doing it or getting it done to you? I've came. I've been, yeah. You've came what? While I was the bottom. Like somebody else was doing something to me. Not from topping. And she'll bite if she comes. <laughs> she'll bite. Like she bit you? She did. I thought you did. If if the court stenographer can read back what she just said, she said it's never happened to her. But now, Lisa's is saying that. No, no, like as a top, Lisa speaks as the, the truth. person, as the person, Sir topping, Lisa's. as the person that's topping is never happened. But as the person that's bottoming, yes. So let's explain so got, what a so top like, and a bottom is. Yeah, I was gonna say let's because explain this. We are not. We are going if, without explaining. If I'm the person. Actually, doing the demo. You're the whipper. Let's call it whipper and whippy, just for people that I'm, are vanilla. If I'm the whipper, no, no chance. You don't come it's from that. No, but if, if you're I'm the person, uh, if I'm the whippy, take it. <laughs> if I'm the whippy, then yeah, it has. the whippy. The whippy. <laughs> I don't think I've ever been whipped. I've been spanked, but not whipped. She is going to whip you today. Just that's so that's fine. Again, I re- remember I, I have the shit tonight and tomorrow and for the rest of my life. I got you uh, good. Real nice she said. Doggers. You can poop stand up. It's okay. You've done it before. Oh, I don't want to do it, though. <laughs> <laughs> You've done it in horrible places, so and you can do it at home. I've got friends ass, in low places. <laughs> That's so, different. I mean, in, in Ooh, I got the person it. that bottoms the fence is like foreplay, so it's going to cause a hormonal reaction. Hormone. Yeah, it causes a hormonal reaction. <laughs> So the next game, the game that we're about to play, it's called Don't Look Away. What's going to happen is I'm going to show you a video. You guys will remove your headphones and listen to the audio. Who thinks they can give the best play-by-play here? Are you good like uh, play-by-play? Lisa, do you think you have a play-by-play? Tell everyone what they're saying because this video can't be shown at home because it's porn, obviously. Okay, I can explain exactly what's going on. I don't know how it's going to, um, but yeah, we can go. All right, so you guys are going to remove your headphones and the audio should play through the TV. Hopefully, I didn't check the audio, but it should. And if you give a play-by-play, if you look away at any time, you will have to take a shot or chug right, your whole beer. I'm going to take a shot regardless. I'm not cold. Huh? cold over here fast. All right, what's going so on, like, Okay, so this young lady was gaping, and then they decided to pour milk into her anus. And... Maybe somebody's going to eat some cereal out of there, but no. But okay. She has a large, 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 large anus. And she is definitely, definitely has invested in her gaping skills. Um, some cereal. Now, this guy has a, a heavy, heavy kink. Yeah, it's cereal. She's going to make that shit bubble. Eat that shit. Oh, no. I want to see if mother going to eat that mother. That's what I want to see. Oh, she farted it out. Where's that shit? Oh, Yo, anal prolapse. Yeah, her Leo, you're missing it. It's so much fun. Either. There you go. That ah, shit. Hey. Man. What the heck? <laughs> I guess it's over. What? I'm trying to get the audio to not... Oh, I have the Bluetooth one. That's the reason the audio is playing through here. <laughs> I've seen that shit in person. So. You've seen anal prolapse in person? I've seen that shit in person. Yeah, I'm good. I've seen that shit. All right, Theo. I'm very familiar. Don't make me realize that shit. As, as you're I'm eating come on. food, why does it go? <laughs> <laughs> I've never done it. I mean, no, see, you be... What did I do? What did I do? This should be disgusting. All right. Uh, 
as you continue. To I see now that ah, because I've seen that like that shit oh, is crazy. Oh, yeah. oh, 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 that's sounding. Yeah, yeah no, look how know. far, look how like why that sound yeah. is. Listen, that's that's not even that's a bum normal type shit. My shit is crazy. Yeah, are you guys into it? I've seen oh. that in person too, but that shit is oh goodness. Harley, have you ever done that to somebody? Crazy. No, I don't know how to do that. Jesus, have you ever had that done to you? I would not. Listen, I can't even. <laughs> I mean, but I feel like I would try it though. Yeah. I would do it. I've seen it, uh, oh! and I, I have right. a friend that actually does it. That's a, that's a actually a dame, and she does that uh-huh. um, as part of discipline and stuff like that. But that motherfucker, oh my goodness, that shit is. is you, know, you know what's crazy? The sounding part is the hole in the thing. So I wanted to go to the end of it. See. The cum actually come comes out from the hole. Get the fuck out of here! Do you okay to escape it? Yeah. <laughs> Look at me hiding in the corner. Hey, listen, I didn't expect that part. The like, cum coming out of the hole. Listen, I didn't. Yeah, I've never seen that shit happen to where. The, the I don't know how you like, can be hard with a Ronnie. Right or here. People Wait, come like, from it. Look at it. I don't like that she's skilled. But I like how you guys aren't looking the way at, at all. Yeah. Theo, um, and all types of shit. Like, just saying. All right, now this is my. I'm going to bust out the um, throw up bag because right. spit. That gets me to throw up. Gonna I, don't, throw up man? I don't can't be, guarantee. Don't be a pussy. I don't want to be a pussy. I'll still watch it <laughs> while I throw up. I don't, don't want to be a pussy. We sell those pussies at the bush. Spit, spit swapping? What's the bush? So you've never spit in your girl's mouth? Huh? I did. The the bushes is, is the is the um, space oh, where we do it's home base where I do the pizza and porn. So we there every Thursday, but it's something going on every day of the week. On? So. Um, it's a great place to to bring a girl for a date night. You know, we come see some kink. You can buy all your favorite toys. You can host a bachelorette party, a bachelor party. We got exotic dancers oh, yeah? on there. Girls and, yeah, guys. girls and guys. You can learn how to do what I do at a night. You know what I mean? Anything. Oh, come on. So the one video I need to work. Parties, drag parties, all types of stuff. Yeah. That video is nice. And now, if you come during my thing, it's all girls there. It'd be literally yeah. me and 40 girls. That's yeah. yeah. Like, the guys don't be one. Try and get the guys to come out to us. All women there. And the women are interested in a guy that wants friend, to try to my learn this. friends come out, and they always meet new friends. Her, oh, guy, yeah. her guy friends that come out want to be beat. <laughs> so, they, do. they want to be beat. You got a lot of Asian friends, friends, I'm guessing? That, that come out there on a the table getting whipped. So yep. there's a whole bunch of girls that want to got at least wants to try to learn it. Mm-hmm. That's a lie. You seen the one? <laughs> you seen the guy? That's all right. All they look all look submissive to me. Here we go. I'm gonna remove my headphones. I normally don't because. Okay, so there you go. Explain. <laughs> 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 <It's laughs> because you never spit in a mouth. You know, <laughs> he gonna throw up in the mouth. <laughs> you never spit in your girl's mouth. <laughs> Damn. Okay. So you never seen it in person, then? Oh, I no, I would never want. I think. Nice oh, they both are hot. <laughs> <laughs> so they both got some nice titties. All right, as long as there's, I don't know what happened. <laughs> I didn't watch this one before. So, let's see if we can get. Uh, got some beautiful. This hair. might be. Oh. Spit on the titties. So they just really spit. spit. On the booth. That's a oh, see. I think I'm getting I'm getting nauseous from hearing you throw up. <laughs> You're enjoying me throwing up? No, I'm not. I'm getting nauseous from you. Uh, so that's what I like. If, uh, if a girl's give me head, I'll uh, <laughs> Come on, Jess. I don't want to walk. <laughs> yeah, he's going. He is going. <laughs> she's gargling that shit. She's spit. <laughs> and spit some more. And some more. And some more. Man, all the way. I can't do it anymore. And the bubbles just roll off her lips. Okay, they just roll off her lips. Oh, my God. You guys are just... You guys. It's just rolling. Go ahead. Spit that shit back out. You ever see Oh, my God. What's wrong with her? I did that shit, right? I've come... No! Came in a girl's mouth, and then they were spitting in their mouth back and forth. Oh, my God. I lost that one. I'll take a shot. I'll do whatever it takes. I just don't ever want to... I hate... Oh, I was supposed to take a shot for that, right? So shot. how do you feel about girl swap and come? Can girl swap come? Are we back on these? What platforms? does that mean? So I come in a girl's mouth, and then she goes and spits it in a friend's mouth, and then they spit it back. It gets a spit, but it's come. That'll probably be worse for you. Yeah, that would be. That would probably sure. be worse for you. The liquid's going in the mouth. Like it can. All right, I need. This is gonna make me throw up. Just looking at. Oh my. Yeah, I spit in mouth. So I'm sorry. I'll do it. Do you get it spit in? No, nah, never, 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 never. So, but I'll spit in the mouth and then I'll lick it off her face if I miss. 
I'm gonna spit it back, my bad. He looking at me like, cuz. <laughs> I ain't mad at none of He know yeah. I don't give a fuck about spit. I'm with you guys. He work. doesn't like sounding. And I didn't get any shit play. I'm sorry. Next time I'll get some shit play. <clears throat> I, listen, I'm start walking out on these segments now. I'm gonna keep it 100. I, I saw. Like, if you, I'm gonna keep it a bit. You follow Twitter. Twitter got, got some got extreme, like, amateur, like, scat, like it's shit. crazy. Like, I literally watched. I get, I get caught up in it. Like, I'll sit and I'll keep going and I'm like, fuck. I want there's so much shit that I've seen, like just in my personally. I know it because I had a friend that used to do this uh, thing with uh, Brutal Masters. You heard of Brutal Masters and um, Brutal which, Masters. That's yeah, they um, they're, they're hardcore, hardcore. What do they do? BDSM, what does that mean? BD, hardcore, hardcore BDS. Like punching hardcore. bitches in the face? No, like she got her breast nailed into a two by four. What? You've uh, seen this in person? <laughs> That's You've seen this? I've I'm seen bad. that in person. Damn, I, she got waterboarded. Somebody else got waterboarded. With dick? What is, what is, what's, the, what's the craziest shit you've ever seen? Um, in person, all, all the same. This is all the same act. Eat scat. Um, the girl getting her breast. This is all the same girl. Getting her breast nailed to a two by four. Who is she? She's a hero. Um, they shaved her head. She had long blonde hair. They shaved her head. This is all part of... She just went through a divorce, huh? And she got waterboarded, but the waterboarding was so crazy because they did, um, they did uh, mm-hmm. bondage on her breast where her shit was purple. That's wild, um, she wild did, you shit, know, man. And then they waterboarded her, but it was so fucking wrong. like they had her neck in a fucking restraint, a wooden restraint, and they were waterboarding her. Under. And that shit, listen, I'm gonna tell you this: you see that shit on those movies where it's like CIA mo or F- like in there. Interrogating somebody, you have no idea till you see that shit in a fucking person. That shit looks like a mother's going to die. You like, can die from it. You definitely can. You can have a, like, I a believe dry, that. A dry, uh, what is it called? A dry drown death or something like that. But um, she did that, and yeah, and then um, they did the battery. Um, that left her with the battery. Uh, um, see, is this girl alive? I haven't spoke to her. <laughs> Do you know who in she? A, you know her in, as a person? In a, in a minute, yeah. Um, I got a um, because I was I haven't seen her in about five years, but I I drove up I drove up there with her and I was I took her back, um, after she got they had a nurse on hand and all that but like they actually had a RN on hand and all that whatever and I drove her back to the hotel room, um, afterwards to make sure she was cool and then they the nurse came to check in whatever so and so but she paid me to do that so you know as a friend i would have done but it was the transporter know, the transporter the pimp yeah not so the wild pimp. shit not the pimp she made a nice amount of money I mean, that's she had a, like that was that's I like told acting. Y'all people get paid to get shitted on so. yeah, yeah or eat mm-hmm. shit how much would you how much what's your price for eating shit Change your life. Bro. It ain't no price. <laughs> <laughs> like, like, Did no we bullshit. say this last week? Yeah, we actually. I think I said fifty thousand dollars. Eating shit, fifty. That's I'm not it. Eating. You lowballing, bro. Lowballing. Listen, I'm not eating shit for a billion. Yeah, if somebody, <laughs> if somebody has fifty thousand dollars in front of you, and there's a piece of poop right there, no. I'm not. Dude. Get the fuck. It's this is all lies. You no, guys, everyone not. says that. How, How you figure? Fifty thousand. Fifty thousand dollars. Change your life right now. It will not change my life yes, right now. Yes, it would. I have fifty thousand now. It's not changing my life. I, I still feel broke. <laughs> like I feel broke fuck. as fuck. I still feel broke. <laughs> don't, don't. I need. Then, I want fifty. If your bank account has fifty thousand, it's not much you can like. What are, you're not living like. You still got to work. <laughs> you I'm not invested in something. That, you That's one this. year of regular work for the I average person. I ain't even lie to you. Just and for a little bit or not. Yeah, yeah, come on. Now. Just you offer me a meal. That is definitely somebody's annual income, but. I mean, that's one year in your income. I need six figures. A million dollars, you eating shit? I just might do it. Who shit is Just my I'm not eating Beyonce? shit. I, I, I need to lie to you. I don't think my pride would let me do it. dollars, would you lick a turd from Beyonce's ass? No. Okay, say this. Say, say you got the chance to eat her butt, and it was just a little bit of the head of the shit just poking out. <laughs> Turtle heading. Uh, y'all really got these scenarios. <laughs> and it was, and it was Beyonce's together. ass spread out, and you diving in, and you got to eat her ass. This is the whole point for a million dollars. You do dive in to eat her ass for a million dollars, right? But you and go in you there, and the turd is a little bit hanging out. Do you renege I, on honestly, the ass? I'm going to keep it a buck. I think that that like like my whole, like where I am today. You got mm-hmm. Touch me a couple years ago, maybe. Not. A million dollars, but right now I'm, I'm not like so. Where it's I'm Beyonce at now, ass. You already gonna eat her ass for good. You so, so you would so eat Beyonce ass for a million dollars? You eat ass, bro. 
Nah, I'm you not like, like, do you like as much no. as I like Beyonce, she look good. I'm not that much of a fan to be how no, everybody no. gonna fan Bro, out on it. The, like, the oh, it's Beyonce. Nah. Do you eat ass though? Yeah. So you wouldn't eat Beyonce? No. Ass. Like, okay. So who who's a star ass that you eat randomly? Who, that, I don't know. Nothing. Like off back, who I'm thinking about? Because you eating a regular girl ass now. I'm not saying you're whoever asked you eating a regular, <laughs> but she ain't you know, worth like a couple billion. I, I can't, I can't say, I can't say off back. Like I don't got nobody in my head right now. Like you know when what? He asks, it's her. Just him doing her? It. Oh, her. I like that. Choice. Who's her? <laughs> I her like that. I do anything to her. I do anything to her. So if the little turd is hanging out of her, uh-huh, ass, her for a bill, <laughs> a billion, and you get the finish off for a billion, and nah, you get the I, finish I, off, I, I ain't going ch- I, I can't chop on her. That's only ass, one part of know. it. All you doing is your tongue is just touching it. You already mm, nah, eat the butt. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna be. I'm gonna be highly upset. <laughs> highly upset with myself as well. I've never heard of her. Yeah, which oh. is crazy. She just took the mask off. Oh, she used to have a mask. Mm, yeah, she she had her face covered for a long time. Nobody knew who she was. That's how Why'd she take it off? She pulled a cane? That's what she looked like? No, I don't no. know. Yeah, this is some bullshit. Okay, I don't know what she looked like. <laughs> Jesus. So have you guys ever hit somebody too hard on stage? On stage? Yeah. You, yeah, because if you hit somebody too hard, they're going to give you a cue that you hit them too hard. So mm-hmm. if you notice me, I do like a lot of non-verbal cues. So I might get to the point, and then they'll put there, or they'll, like two hands is red. Like that was too much. Mm-hmm. I don't like it at all. Um, one hand for me is like a slow down, whatever, you know what I mean? So it happens because sometimes people, they're trying to push. You're, you're consistently pushing somebody's limits, you know what I mean? So my communication, I'm asking them to show me their pain tolerance from one to five. Five is too much. I want to keep them at a four. One is they call me a pussy. Mm-hmm. So I'm always, show me your fingers, and they're like three. And I'm going, 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 going. And, I, and I'll talk and I'll say, you ready to keep going? You want to go push? You want to push? And there's a lot of people that want to push. And then they'll push until they're at their limit. And that's too hard for them. You made them cry? You, know. you made somebody cry on stage before? I make people cry all the time. Sometimes they're, they're tears of joy. Sometimes they're tears from orgasm. And sometimes they're tears from pain. I made her cry. Ah, cry baby, cry baby. You might be in there. No, I'm I didn't make her cry. Oh, shit, damn, I was about to. Draw. She almost made me cry because she bit me. And I'm. <laughs> she's a biter. Like I am a biter, a bad biter. You ever take you some like skin it. off? Yes, she probably did. She's a biter. Yes. Not Little Mike Tyson. Skin. I have a. I got about two people who got like permanent bite marks on them from me. Took off an ear? No, uh, I don't take off bite marks. <laughs> you got your mic on. <laughs> I don't take off bite marks. Literally. Parts. Have you ever hit somebody too hard on stage? Not on stage, no. What's the hardest you've ever bit somebody? Enough for them to have permanent marks still there. Well, well you got to explain what the permanent mark is. It's like a round. <laughs> like they got like a permanent like a zombie permanent, bite. A permanent round mark, like with teeth marks. Yeah. But you didn't take the skin. You just bit really hard. I mean, no, I probably I took a, a chunk out of somebody man, before. Mark. I've got, listen. I You're got like an Asian zombie. From spanking. You see that shit? Can you see it on that side? Mm-hmm. I got scratched from spanking a girl. Mm-hmm. And I told her, that I, instead of giving a safe word, I said, we get when it's getting too much, she liked to scratch it. I said, just scratch me, and I'll know when you're done. When you, I said, when you, I said, when you, when you start to come, scratch me. And she did just that and scratched straight down my arm, and that mark has been there from me smacking this girl. Yeah. If she got murdered that night, just know that you were going to jail for life, bro. <laughs> Man, that scratching shit for real. I got scratched my back, and shower felt like hell for a second. Is it still there? Uh, I don't know. I haven't looked in a while. Ain't you know, that. but I ain't gonna lie. I thought I could endure pain. And t- oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. And that shit, she is digging. You do I enough of that digging. to replay. Oh my god, that digging shit. That ah, it's it's okay. You get used to it. You get used to Who it. Who wants to? Get, never mind. You guys, obviously. Yeah, <laughs> I was gonna say uh, <laughs> the point uh, of the man. episode. Yeah, my fault. <laughs> Has anyone ever hit you guys back? <laughs> yes. Go yes. ahead, tell the story. Yes. I flogged somebody's chest and they hit me with the flogger. They hit me. They said, What the fuck, bitch? <laughs> and they came after you? No, I was standing right there and kind of just kept flogging each other, but it made for a really great scene because nobody knew we were like kind of fighting. So it was really good. I could choke him, he could choke me. <laughs> it was a guy? Yeah, it was a guy. Why are you actually. Um, you oh, shouldn't I'm be. Sorry. It, I, was a, it was a male. I, I should be surprised by that answer. It was a penis holder. 
A pe- okay, a penis that's holder. <laughs> that sounds so a sophisticated. A dick-carrying member of the dick club? A penis holder. He's a penis What about you, Lou? Um, to be honest, only them and her friends, because they do the same thing I do. So I'll fuck around with them when they walk walking by. I'll be like, come here, bitch. And, I, and they be like, and they'll turn around with that shit. Where'd you get that whip from? And I won't know. So we do it in, like playing wise. Not me doing an actual scene with somebody. No, that's never happened. But with them, I'll walk by and I'll smack ass. And they, 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 they thrive at the opportunity, some of them, to catch me back at some time. You know, but we play like that. You know like what I mean? white teenagers where you guys just have, like, whips in your pocket. Like, I can't wait to get this bitch when she walks by. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, it will be. You know, like, I've, like, she's hit That's me with a, a, with, a, with a thing before. Just start carrying whatever. a whip on you. A fold. Is there fold-up whips, I'm guessing? You can do it. Um, they could be made of power cord. Jesus, that sounds it's like a, a murder weapon. I have you can the hold that up. oh no no or the the wire one that I have in there. That's I can't one. put that in my pocket though. Nah, you can't. That's but that's a, that's a, that's some painful pocket. stuff. But it's way more painful stuff than what I have. But I have some painful stuff. I gotta pay up there back. I'm stuck. <laughs> this is so different now because in the other studio, you mean the bathroom is like directly behind me. I don't have to go see. So now we gotta go all out. <laughs> So back to you, kinky motherfuckers. Right. Hey, what's up, kinksters? You, you know, I'm chilling, you know, my chicken and the biscuit. You know what, I, like taste a I thought you was putting cheese like on it. So you just purposely buy that. Oh, that was just here as a snack. No, this is me. I went to the store. With so look, I had a little stint. This is because I'm an entrepreneur. I used to work at like a family dollar. And I used to steal these off the shelf. <laughs> when I was hungry and it was like 99 cent or something or a dollar or something so I'm like man they ain't gonna be mad over this ain't gonna do this shit then I started buying them because I was like man they too good to steal man. <laughs> fuck that shit man I'm pretty good mm. kicking on the biscuit but I was just about to ask you something I forgot that quick um <clears throat> but I might 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 pop out to uh one of them piece and porns Ugh. like my lady friends come on that's a good place to introduce a girl to some kink shit man they- well I I'm and, like, the lady friends I'm gonna bring out, I ain't gonna be fucking them. They just gonna be my friends. Bring them all. The bushes are sex toy store. They, they, they are my fishing rods. That's he get the game. <laughs> they your wingman? He gets it. Huh? They your wingman? They're just my it. fishing rods. So you could definitely pull more girls when you're with girls. No, real shit. They just like to talk. Yeah. And, and, and I ain't even gonna lie to you, man. I know how to talk to them. No. I know how to talk to them. <laughs> Still was trying to make it? <laughs> oh, I got skinny again. Did you get a whole other thing? Oh, no, I got a couple more trulies. There's not any more Miller Lights, I don't think. That was, that was the next door. I just grabbed what was in the fridge. That was the last oh, one. She didn't even finish her fireball. We ain't going to trip. So, you, oh, it, how bad. good of a wingman oh, is yeah. she? I think that, is that what you guys were just talking about? She is the ultimate wingman. I ain't going to hold you. She encourages all the fuckery. Does she, does she ever steal your girl that you're trying to get? That I'm trying to get or a girl that's trying to get me? Because I don't ever try to get girls try to get me. No, you just... But she has she has pulled some girls that have tr- like uh, or she'll say so are we fucking her? <laughs> like are we- have you guys fucked together? <laughs> what have you guys had sex with in a group setting or together in the same in place? A group setting in the same place like orgy? Yeah, like anything. Not like an orgy. What about like together? Bang, bang. Like a swing party? Type like has this penis been inside you anywhere? Sheesh. That is a that is a hardcore like, question. Might be a, hard a lot of things we've he looked answered it earlier. I don't know why you even asked the question, bro. <laughs> I plead a fifth. I plead fifth. Damn. Oh, you guys. I feel like I, I feel like it was we are guess. we are co professionals. Yeah, yeah, they fucking. Yeah, they fucking. Talk about, talk about, talk about, <laughs> talk about peers and coworkers. Uh-huh. You guys have jobs outside of this, correct? Yes. Do they know what you do? Where you work at? Um, at a place. Like what kind of? You don't have to say That's where you work. What kind of job do you have outside of this? In healthcare. I'm in a mental health field. <laughs> do you ever think that maybe you need the mental health? Yes. Do you ever think? <laughs> <laughs> I feel like I help a lot of people with mental health issues mm. in and outside of work. You know. Yeah, I was in a mental health facility. Facility working or in there? Working, yeah. It did. I mean, that did came out like crazy. That, yeah, it came like, out crazy. Like I mean, this nigga cool. retarded. You here now? You made it. <laughs> this nigga retarded. No, 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 I'm good. Nah, 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 nah. But I, I did 302 a couple people, especially the women, because they're crazier than the motherfucker. Yeah, I did. Yeah, I used to work with adults with schizophrenia. Um, this lady's poor as shit. 
she shit on herself and then took her hand and like put it on the doorknobs in and out. Yeah, I would touch the doorknobs the rest of the night. I went out through the back door. I think she's just a joker. I think she's just funny. No, who the, the lady that did yeah, that? Yeah, I think she was just trying to get a, you know a good laugh out of you. No, you know what it is? She was fucking crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Little old white lady, like no real shit. She was like, she was just yelling all crazy shit. She rang the doorbell to get in. We went to let her in. We was like, what is she doing? She was in her shorts, and she's like, she like she got a little crazy walk. The crazy. Walk. And so she got it in her hand, and she opened the door. <laughs> the little crazy. And walk. then when she opened the door, and she like kind of like pulled the shit, even though it comes by itself, it's gonna hit you in your ass as you go. You she didn't want you to see the shit. I looked at my coworker like I ain't touching none of that, none of that shit, <laughs> none of it. Shit on the floor. <laughs> yeah, I'm good, man. I left the mental health facility. <laughs> I, I quit that day. That's what I quit. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Around like a month later, I was like, you know what? This is this, this too much for me. I'm going to go back to me. these other people. So you guys both talked about how a previous relationship kind of led you to the life you live now. Can you have a steady relationship, meaning monogamous, in the field you're in? I choose not to be. Yeah, I, I don't. I give two shits about monogamy right now. How? <laughs> Could I? Or, no. What? I don't want to say. You can say your exact age if you want. You're a guy. I mean, I'm 41. You don't think about ever getting married? Yeah, and it's going to be some type of polyamorous, polyamorous dynamic if I get married. So I will get married, and we will have a girlfriend, or you know, or a situation, or you know, depend on whatever. We or we might we might date a couple. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? That might be it. Or I might have. It's, it's so many different dynamics, but it's never. I'm gonna always have. A, I'm gonna have some type of submissive in my life. So. Say if I marry Keisha, and Keisha knows that Erica is my sub, so that's what's going to have to happen. So right now, dating looks like, hey, this is all I'm available for if you're going to continue. So I tell someone, you can you can um, engage with me for a play date. That's just flat out fucking. Hey, I'm interested. You're interested. Let's go fuck. You can engage with me because you're interested in getting to know me. But if you get to know me, it's going to be some type of polyamorous dynamic at the end of the day. So I'm going to always bring somebody in and we're going to be hanging out with other girls and all that stuff. So I got to put that from the beginning. <clears throat> so are you are you on like a dating website to find women or you're good? You, I'll jump right on Tinder like, hey, I'm filing. <laughs> Swipe right. <laughs> you have to put you probably put your height first, right? Seven foot eight. Six five blue eyes. <laughs> that's what I, five that's five the most brown light skin shit ever, man. <laughs> that's what I leave with. It's the light skin nigga, man. I'm brown skin at heart though. So, <laughs> I don't know. They didn't look away during the game. I don't go a fuck. And what go, they did. going well for Stormy's rules. That's the light skin thing to do. I, I don't, know. don't give a fuck skin. about what they did. I'm not watching that nasty shit. Ain't nobody. I'm not watching nobody spitting no fucking. Sounding is the dumbest shit ever in the history. I don't care what y'all say or anybody says. It's okay. That shit is disgusting. Like, why are you pitting something in your dick hole? I'm pretty sure that shit is he painful. He liked having STD testing, and he went further. Oh, my <laughs> God. That shit hurts. That that, a, that's oh. the back of the day one, man. That shit used to be the worst. I think it's just blood work. When they actually man. had to, like, and you like, man, I'm... I'm like, I, I'm, I'm, I'm cool with just guessing. <laughs> I'm cool with just guessing. I'm good. Yeah. If, if, Wait, someone has to go, if someone has to go in my dick hole, I'm cool with guessing. I'm good. Like, yeah. <laughs> it's like, fuck it. I'm going to just rock out. Yeah. I ain't feeling that yet. If I die, I die. <laughs> if I die, I die. That's he dies, true. he dies. That's nasty. <laughs> Harley? I'm not doing monogamous nothing. Have you been in a relationship where it was monogamous since you've been into the, or ever? I've been in monogamous relationships. They turned out to be non-monogamous relationships, so I'm keeping that same energy. But did they change to, you said poly, right? They changed to non-ethical monogamous relationships, meaning someone who didn't exactly want to be truthful about the things that they were doing. Is that you or the person? The person. So is that the, did somebody (coughs) cheat on you so bad that you're like, you know what, I'm going to go and fuck around now? No, just, so I'm bisexual. So I like, you don't have to lie to me. Mm -hmm. Like, you want to fuck a bitch? We can fuck a bitch. You don't have to lie to me. We don't, you don't got to sneak around. You ain't got to cheat. You don't got to do nothing. Like, I mean, I might have some boundaries when it comes to other females, but like, you don't have, like, it don't got to be a secret. What what if she don't want, what if he want to bring her in, but she don't want to fuck you? She just wants you to watch. Do she got nice boobs? 
She's nice. Oh, are you a boobs or a butt girl? I like boobs. I love boobs. So you like white girls, huh? If she has nice boobs and a fat ass. Mm. If her ass jiggles. Do you have like a preference on the kind of girl you like or the guy you like? So if you're build, you're building your Barbie and Ken, let's say this. What um, do they look like? So my Barbie and Ken has to have common sense because if I can't have a conversation with you. But you're just I, having sex. Come no, on now. No, no. I got to have a conversation with you. Like, you might be so stupid that I might want to grab your hair and you might, like, it just might be too technical. I feel like you fucked a lot of dumb guys and girls then. Nothing. Because this is the first thing you said. Yeah, so, like, I'm an in-person type of, like, I don't do internet nothing. Like, I can't really date via the internet, get to know people like that. I, like, want to meet you in person first. But you're building a Barbie and Ken. These people are just there to fuck you. <laughs> I'm not him. What you mean me? I don't just meet people and fuck about? them. So wait, 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 I, what? I don't know do how to I do just that. meet people and fuck them? Did you just say that? What do you mean? Do I just meet people and fuck them? I mean, I'm a swinger, so I can recreationally he and socially recreational. have sex. Okay. Like, I you might go it. to, you might go to um, the bar for wings. I'm going to the bar to fuck. So, I can't do And everybody that. that's coming with me to the bar is going for that. I can't you do know? it. So, I'm going to the bar that the people are going to that bar to fuck. That's I can't do it. Social outing to find someone to fuck. Mm. I need to have conversations first. Social sex. You can't be stupid. Recreational. <laughs> I don't think I could do social recreational sex. Like, well, obviously now I'm in a relationship. But I like that. Theo's problem right now is he's like, how am I going to pay? Am I going to crawl oh under the table? <laughs> table? <laughs> he made it. <laughs> He's made it to the promised land. <laughs> he crawled under the table. I was, I, I was telling Robbie, I was like, I might have to crawl under the table. The guy who owns the studio. <laughs> so, what's like the softest toy you can use on somebody? What's like the easiest one? Like feathers. That's feathers. Feathers. That's yeah, like that's, that's like beginner that shit. Borderline feathers. No, that's just like real soft, sensual. <clears throat> I usually like, start with that. Is that like rookie stuff? Like that's how you work people into what you do. No, I ain't gonna say rookie. If you're doing sensory play, some people skip it because a lot of people get out of the the whole um, the build up the the sensory stuff. Because um, some people are just flat out straight into impact play and in the pain. They don't need all that extra stuff, you know. What's I mean? the difference between sensory and impact? Well, impact is anything that's causing an impact, mm -hmm. whether it's your hand or an object or any, you know, um, that's anything. Anywhere on the body. That's impact. Sensory is your senses. So sensory play can be touch, can be smell, can be visual, can be, you know, anything that's your one of your senses. Um, mm. And you do something to, like, maybe enhance it or do something to uh, trigger a sensory reaction. So mm. that's what sensory play would be. Electric is sensory play. Mm -hmm. It's electric play, but it's sensory play. Um, me just, like, tickling her skin. Rub my finger down. Just touch. You see how she buzzed a little bit? Touch. You get off on that? Is that like... Now this you? will be impact. <laughs> impact. Do you like... Which one did you like the most? <laughs> Good I like the sensory. Because it didn't hurt? It didn't hurt. I'll, I'll take the sensory. I'll take the sensory. 500. <laughs> <laughs> so what do you think like is the hardest toy, like the worst toy to use, most extreme toy kind of thing? Single tail whip. What the hell is that? An actual whip. Oh, well. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah, that's vicious. That can... That, that nipple can, clamps. Huh? No, nipple I, clamps. I don't know some people that can take nipple plants like a champ, and it does not affect them at all. So I don't man. like... I, I have a video, actually, if you want to see the video. <laughs> no, I, I, I don't... I might actually be able to pull it up here, but it was a... Uh, so we had Erotic Boudoir on here, Nick from Erotic Boudoir. She was like a sex shop. Mm -hmm. Then I made a promo video with my girl for her thing. Go to eroticboudoir.com and then type in love and then what for your next promo code. Mm -hmm. 10% off, twenty five dollars more. But yeah, I was like tied up with like nipple clamps so on. I'm not again, I'm very vanilla, but I'll 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 do anything it. for somebody. Yeah, I don't care. I'll try anything once. Besides, I don't, well, I'm actually going to try it tonight. So I can't say I want to try getting spanked and tickled a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> can't wait until Theo has to go under the table again. Yeah. Under the seat, under the seat. There's, try that one. there's no way. <laughs> It's an expensive camera. Watch it. Oh, you got, got, got it. Got Holy shit. Okay, yeah. no. So what's a tool you guys won't use? Won't use? Yeah. 
Like, um, I don't do like needles. Needles is a thing. Needles is a thing. It is she like thing. needles. Do you like yeah. needles? Yeah. I like needles. What do you want to be injected with? No. <laughs> Shit. What, what do you mean? <laughs> okay. Um, don't act like I'm weird. Don't act like I'm weird when you say you like needles and not, I say. Not syringes. Mm, okay. The needle itself. You want to be stabbed? In, they come in gauges. So you want to be stabbed? So I have a picture of like uh, different gauges of needles on my thigh. Just in my thigh going up and like six Yeah, I, I couldn't run across none of your, your chicks. And, you know uh, saying, because <laughs> so all the thing, aggressive shit they like. People do blood painting and it's a thing. And they like put needles and spray with alcohol. You know, alcohol causes you to bleed more. Beat on it a little bit, cause a little bit of pain. Take the blood, paint on you. Oh, with she your own blood. is. She so wait, where do you like to be? I'm gonna call it stabbing. You can call it what you want to call it. Where do you like to be stabbed? I've only tried needles on my thigh. Okay. Just imagine swiping on Tinder. Like, oh, she looks nice. I, like, I, <laughs> I, I, I hundred percent. I don't know how to do it. I'm going to learn. But um, I don't even want to learn. I'm I've cool. only tried it like two or three Leave times. It causes like a sting. Yeah, you're being stabbed. I mean, and then no weave it's it, like a tattoo no, though. Weave it through your skin, and it'll be like. I mean, they and got out, it. it has, out, you need an insert in the exit wound. You need an insert in the exit You gotta show. You gotta. If you, you should have pulled it up. You no, know, just, like a, just, just imagine me and her at the Let bar, me right? I'm gonna see if I can. Just find imagine me and her at the bar. You meet her at the bar. You buy a drink. Y'all like, and now y'all talking some little kinky shit. You like, yeah, this and So you get back to the crib, she whip your ass. And then, you then you're tied up, and she's putting needles in your nipples. Now your nipples. Oh up man! Imagine you waking up and she doing now some extra shit. Now to your you. nipples up here. You in a pretzel. But what she's gonna do is, is gonna get. She's gonna get consent first. She's gonna get the. I'm gonna you know, get cute consent girl, first. She's gonna get consent. Can I do what I want to you? And you gonna look at her a little drunk, like yeah, you can yeah, do whatever. And you be like, well, sign it. Show me that you were, and I'm gonna take you home. You like. I'm Pussy, this pussy. You think you get a pussy? You sliding your nipples away and all that shit. And then she gonna stick it with the thing. She gonna do the uh, the sound and then you and all that shit. Yeah, you can, I don't even do you can send it to that, bro. You know what I'm gonna start doing when I meet chicks at the bar and they start acting like that. You know, leave this. <laughs> well, yeah, I'm like, right, I'm gonna holler at you. See? I holler at you. That's you know what I'm saying? That's a good shit. You know this you know, nigga? You know the boy. Tall ass light skin nigga. Look at this nigga. That do that pizza. Matter of fact, I got a video on beating a girl with a hammer. You know him? Yeah, <laughs> hell yeah. I, you probably shouldn't show them cool. a picture of him. Just ask. So Harley, wow. what's, a, what's the picture gonna do? They might they might leave you. Who? Yeah, blue eyes. What that mean? Oh, you ain't never sharing. been in a setting with me. Then you sharing. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you know I'm saying that. It's not the taking it's the light hey, skin, it's the light skin in his brother, but I know, I know that. I know that when it, when I whisper a couple words in a few ears after a while, it, it gets. Whisper words. You know what I'm saying? I, I, I it don't even sound like that. It's just like, damn, how you doing? That's how I talk. <laughs> be like, damn, yeah, your voice so exactly I'm like soothing. They be like, and that's know. how you get them. And that's I'm how I'm what you was them. drinking. <laughs> What you was drinking? Look, look, and we'll be just talking to it like, listen, oh, no. I feel like it'd be game all night. I don't even strapped up care next time. About what you, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> strapped up for real. Had it is. Still my hand on my gun. <laughs> What's going on in this motherfucker? <laughs> man, I can shoot with my toes. <laughs> so, so, Harley, what's a toy that you won't use since you're using needles? He said he wouldn't use needles. Um, you're obviously more extreme. Yeah. Um, yeah I'm not really using uh, the things. What's Chainsaws? The, no. I'm definitely not using. I'm not using power tools unless it's a, a drill dough. Drill dough. Yeah. Wait, there are people that use power tools. Drill dough. They yeah. put a power dildo on a power yeah. tool. Yeah. Um, I'm not using. Real, for, real, for I don't use whips. I'm not really good with whips. Um, so I'm not using whips at this moment. Um, I'm not using anything that is going to cause the in, the inside of you to uh, be enlarged. Like the stretch, you. like stabbing somebody, something um, like that. I'm not gonna stab you, but I will do knife play and drag a blade across you. <sighs> the back end, right? Like the soft end. No. I mean, I might beat you with that. <laughs> I think. I that. like daggers. So, do think. you like this? Do you like blood in your sex? Like, do you want there I to be? I do not want blood in my sex during your sex. But I, I <laughs> no, in it. Thing like, it. It's cool. I like people run red lights. Yeah. <laughs> she said, "Yeah." I pass yeah. on. The, I pass on. You ain't never run a red light. In my life, but yeah. I pass on it though. Yeah. Wait, does running a red light mean only sex, or does that mean going down on a girl? Oh, I ain't never going down on nobody. Well, I'm only asking because Jeez. of the company. <laughs> I think they say it's like a van. I'm thing. looking it's, for it's, needles right now. <laughs> my my man did that shit, and we clowned him forever. I mean, you can stay. No, on the I clit. I've had sex with girls on their period. No, you, that's no problem. You can stay on the clit. There's no blood there. You can eat pussy. Uh, that's fine. 
all, all, all well and fine. I'm gonna just wait it out. <laughs> okay. Me, 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 personally. She is properly caring huh? for herself she and has a proper. Um, she got fibroids. Period. I think we should actually get into some of these toys. Oh, okay. You guys ready to demonstrate some of your uh, yes. some of your stuff? Yeah, we can, we can She's like, <laughs> She's like, let's yeah, get into it. Now I know. Okay. <laughs> so, what do you do after you get like after one of these things? What do you do to like tame your ass? Tame my ass. To fix it. <laughs> So aftercare, <laughs> aftercare is uh -huh. a thing. So it could be like a massage. Um, yes. It could be like some cuddling. <laughs> some people like sex is their aftercare. Um, they like chocolate. I recommend chocolate. Okay, um, I need some chocolate when I get home. Yeah, chocolate, some um, <laughs> soda. Well, we're just gonna go first. Though. Whatever you do to her, she can do back to me. Okay, we'll I'll make that. So let's go with the different types of toys. Ah, and you so, can explain what they are. Well, let's start with let's start with a flogger. Let's start with a flogger. We start with that flogger. This flogger. Oh, that's what you start with. Yeah. Not 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 this cute little small stuff like this. Oh, one. Right. Like you look. Okay, now, is this so sensory or what is this? So this is okay, so I'm gonna show you two ways. So this is impact. So this is a flogger. So these, if you feel the material, so everything up here, all these floggers. Um, have a different material. These are called falls. So you get on um, right. the material um, that you desire. You'll have somebody make you. Everything up there is custom made. Yeah. Okay. So this is a very light um, suede. So if you feel it, you feel it's like it. curtains. Yeah, you feel light of this. Oh, so yeah. no, no, we're gonna do the front. Uh, we're gonna do the front. Uh, so I use these. I call these my titty, my titty floors because they're soft. I can actually anywhere. I can hit the face with them. You know what I mean? Because they're real soft. So. With these, I always use for the breast because they're not as intense, you know what I mean? Um, they got a nice feel, but if I want to use them as sensory, I'm going to rub them on her skin. Let her feel them. Cold washing. So now it's a sensory, okay? Because I'm using the material to rub on her, but then I'll get into impact. So now, I'm at a stage where I'm not doing a lot. It's, it's, she feels it, you know, it's not too hard, but I can get a little, okay? So I add a little, I'm pushing up the face, to get a different sensation. And I'll come in, now I'll go to sensory, do a little rubbing, let her feel it. But then I might want to add a little power to it. Ooh. Now what she will do, if it gets too much, she'll cue me, she'll put a hand up. Okay. Alright. So that's just how I'm going. So typically I'll be doing this with her breast out, but I wanna hit her nipples. See I wanna add a little. Mm. See? Did you are you enjoying this by the way? <laughs> no, I'm not going so but I always tell her to put her face up, whatever, so and so. So alright? So you wanna show her? Oh, yeah. Oh, fuck. <laughs> you never said that. Your turn, Josh. Put the titties out. <laughs> Put the titties out, Josh. Josh, take my shirt off. I mean, you can do you it. You can do to. that. She can't do that without what you keep it afloat. You don't have to, but we can if nah. you want to. You'll feel it more if you feel it on your. I, I normally don't take my shirt off for any reason. <laughs> I don't have to edit it, so I don't really care. If you're doing what I'm doing. <laughs> Now, position it so she will this position is this right? All right, I don't, don't when you stand up straight. <laughs> you can put your hands behind your back or yeah, you can lean on that. Hold your head back though. Okay? Oh, Jesus Christ. Flick it with the car wash, yeah. <laughs> I'm nervous. <laughs> I'm so nervous. <laughs> oh, shit. So sensory. <laughs> Hold your head back. Oh, Coming shit. To the side. I feel like Theo should be next, yeah? <laughs> <laughs> See how weird. Oh, shit. Get the titties. Are my titties jiggling? That's a yes. Oh, <laughs> I'll keep my shirt on just for shits. <laughs> okay, so we'll go to um, 
So dual flog is gonna be a little bit more intense. Um, got a little bit more bite. So, so what is that? So these ones are actually vegan leather. You said so, vegan? Yeah. So, so you they don't eat meat? Not say they don't eat. So you feel the difference in them when you when you're changing oh, the flow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So uh, oh, yeah. these I typically don't use on a breast because they're gonna stink. Okay. So I would use these on the ass or on the back because you can also like I'll put it right down there because it's still unpacked up here. But that's a different type of sensor. So let's just say I want. But you feel the you hear the difference in the smack. I'm watching it differently now that I know it's gonna happen to me. <laughs> so I'm gonna do two different types. Like I, the, these are the floors that I'm gonna do. He's gonna do the Florentine floor. So I'm a little bit more on the impact. Oh, okay. So if I wanna put it. So then I always come into a little bit of rub. I guess she didn't give you the, the I little did bit of rub. rub. So <laughs> don't rub me. Don't rub me. When I, I do rub. rub, when I do rub, I'm feeling to see how warm she is. You know what I mean? Um, because I might need to go to another area if it's a little too warm um, before I start. But if I'm gonna give her a little bit of impact on the back, I always start a little. Oh, there we go. And then you let her feel it sometimes. You gotta let her feel it. You let her feel it. Let me feel it. Let her feel it. Did you come back? Oh. All right, you ready? No, I'm not ready. <laughs> no, no, no. Are you ready to? <laughs> yeah. Oh. Wow. All right. All right. All right. You don't gotta bend over. You don't gotta bend over. Yeah, you can do your back. <laughs> you can just stand up. All right. How hard? Are you? You're not gonna do that hard. No, I'm not gonna do as hard as you can. Yo, you're big. why do you I got hair on one side of your back? One side I have hair on. <laughs> I don't know what my back looks like. What does my back look like? I was like, you see it on the right side? This side like, is just more here and on this side. Oh, I don't know. Alright, we're gonna start the sensory so you can feel it. Oh, it's cold. <laughs> it's cold. Oh, those lines that I feel on here? Oh, so. Oh. Keep murdering your ass. <laughs> you gotta do the ass first. You can do the shoulders. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. I'm not as bad as Luke. You gotta let me fill up a little bit though. Here you go, some music for you. Oh, shit. Was that bad? No, it wasn't bad. It wasn't bad, but it shocked your system, right? It's like the thought that, like, what's gonna happen next? It shocked you, right? It's like, what's gonna happen next? We got a couple of things to go through. I feel like we're going to the butt now, right? Let's get to the. Alright. Oh, so, no. Do you have any? Yeah, it's a big one. Or, let's do a. Um, okay. We'll do the big one. Alright. So, we got to move over some because it's, I'm hitting everything now. Alright. So, this is what you've been wanting. Nice. You've been wanting a car a lot. <laughs> <laughs> so, I mean, this, is my, this is my favorite. I mean, not favorite, this is what people normal, but this big one right here is what people usually see when they see that. So this is always like, gets, gets the attention, but this was made specifically for that. That's why I had so many falls, so I'm like, I want something that I can twirl easy and do that. But this is, I use for ooh, that. Now does that hurt more or does it sound like it hurts more? It actually sounds like it hurts more because there's more falls in it. So now when I go here, I'm putting it on my back because I'm gathering all the falls, okay? Uh, so this is my personal trademark flaw when I do this. So I start off like this. I throw it on my back, then I'll come into a... Right there. <laughs> You ready? Oh, Wait, I gonna, no, let's see you do this. You can't do it with the thing in your hand. You gotta put the biscuits down. See, it's always impossible to get him not have food in his hand. So, mom's <laughs> been. What I'm doing <laughs> is, find the right? And I'm, and you're a little lower than me. A lot lower than me. <laughs> so I'm putting the cheek and I'm wrapping. If you hear it, it always hits my back. Come gathering. I'm aiming right for the cheek. I'm aiming for the pockets. Popping when it gets there. 
No, it's just off the face. I did smack my shit. Hold on, hold on. <laughs> now, this how you be. Your face is better. <laughs> oh, hold on. There you go. Who's better? Me. Come on, man. <laughs> Show you one more. Wait, so, wait, show, show, show. Now you're gonna do the figure eight. Ready? Oh, good. I only want. This looks like the most fucked up porn I've ever seen. <laughs> <laughs> this is not poor, this is law. And then what? see the ends now this is the difference so these are two different types of impact if I use this end this is going to break skin okay. like, I can see you that show that if you use that that's gonna break skin so I use them dual <laughs> and then, yeah, you 
Shane doesn't want to bet. What's your pain at right now? Uh, like a three. Wait, we're gonna be already dead. Yeah, you wanted, you wanted to go All to right. it. You wanted to go to it. We got a wobble in the way. Oh! <laughs> Jesus, that does hurt. So you gotta tell where you at. Where you at? When you get to a one, you'll keep going. You get to a two, two, three, four. Already? Five. <laughs> oh! You got a five already? Well, I'm not used to this. I don't know what's supposed to happen, but right now, things are happening back there. I think a flat jump. Oh, that was good. <laughs> she got me on the good one, man. Wait, you gotta let me rub. No, no, I gotta go for no rubs. <laughs> I don't, I don't want the rub. I don't want the rub. Okay, what are you going to do? Look at him. You just signed the rub tickle. Don't know how to do the. No. The pop it. Don't know how to do the whip. Okay. Nope. Mm -mm. All right, let's go with oh, the shirt. <laughs> I wouldn't even wear. I wear a shirt on pool, so. Oh, let's go to some. Oh, no, I got you. There we go. <laughs> there we go. Huh? What the fuck is that? Lollipop, 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 lollipop. Hold it. Can we can you just do one on each side? That's it. <laughs> you ready? You get two more? What? Okay. <laughs> two more. She's not hard. Right. So you won't give him four. Go. There you go. Huh? Sorry, bro. Oh, <laughs> <Jesus>. <laughs> Sorry, bro. <laughs> Sorry, bro. You want to do one of these? Sorry, bro. Let's <laughs> stay in once. Sorry, bro. <laughs> this boy is. You got what you got in your pocket? <laughs> His wallet. His wallet. Why are they no phone? Can't get, get to that butt cheek. That should have get shot. <laughs> oh, it's not gonna hurt that bad, right? It's gonna be. Easy. Mm -hmm. I give him a little more than that. You only get four of them. Same you thing we belly you up. <laughs> so that's not too bad. That was like a that's a four. She is belling you out. Oh, see, talking shit. See? No, no, no. I think she's a good person. I'm saying she's a good person. I think he's never experienced it. Okay. Are you more than one? Is that the bad? Is this the worst one? One on each cheek, right? You do one on each cheek. Is this the worst one? No, this is not the worst one. No. Did I even pull out the worst one? No. No, I didn't. No, I did. It's right here. Mm. This is the worst one. Yeah, that is the worst one. Alright, so, let's see. Oh. Oh. Ah. You're only getting two, so she gotta give you some up behind. You can give me some up You don't have to, Mel. <laughs> you now remember, I've been nice this whole time. He's been he so sensitive. And he put his wallet back in his pocket. <laughs> I'm trying to protect my. <laughs> 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 If my butt is black and blue, my girl's gonna be a little upset. Alright, we're not gonna turn it black and blue. It's gotta be black and blue. You like it's gonna be black It's already there, it's gonna be black and blue. It's not gonna be black and blue. It's okay, it's not even that bad. Wait, I'm just like, yeah, I know, I'm not even that bad. Hey, you need the cheese. Let me see, what else where are we gonna go to? Uh, let's get a couple with this. This ain't bad. This you can get a, you can get them a couple of these. Oh, this is like a, the melt between wings. This is uh, easy. Now you can make this. No, you can make it. Yeah, you can. That's the type that's standing. This is percussion. Yeah. <laughs> it actually works on the skin though. I can believe it. You know what? I think you chew out a little harder than you've been going with you with this one. I think this one's soft. Okay. All right. I think this one's soft. All right. You're going far. There you go. <laughs> Bro, I think it's funny. Oh, why did I say that? Harder! Hit me harder! It's hard. I can't hit you that hard. We can't break it. That's easy. That's easy. Oh, okay. I'm gonna turn around. Right. See, I told you. They call you a pussy. Don't touch me, my dear. Oh, what is that? I like those. The meat, the meat crumb? She good with these. Yeah, I actually got a video of you doing these. With these? Yeah. So I do this. Because if you don't know if you're blindfolded, that audio right there, ask somebody in the crowd, so it's going crazy when you're in there. You need 
crazy means scared, yeah? Yeah, I mean, yeah. It sounds like a shotgun yeah. getting, like, wrecked. And especially the music is playing, this is, this is a thing over all the sound. This. And then I'll go to the beat. No, um, I have a playlist that I go through. So, yeah. What's your favorite song? What's your least favorite song? Um, uh, my favorite song. My favorite song is Peach. Peach. What's Peach? <laughs> what's, what's Peach? It's about ants. <laughs> who's Who's a buy? I thought Ludacris would sing Peach. No, um, actually, I don't even know what that song is about. It's on my playlist though. I don't like these. I don't like the flat things. They scare me. Peach and it's in a uh, what's the really of a. Uh, All right, so look, this is what he did. It's cold. You walk to that motherfucker from that. No, like. I don't know what it feels like. Yet. I'm thirsty. I'm stuck on every leg. Play the Ronnie horse. Oh, Nelly. <laughs> what is wrong with you? Why am I laughing the whole time? Alright, let me say, what are we doing? Uh, let me say, she have a little whip. Um, yo, 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 Let's get to the craziest one. What's the craziest? You can show them though. You can do it one time with me. Okay, you can so show them. But drag, I don't. A dragon tongue whip. I don't know what you do. So, it's kind of like I'm bringing. You doing my shoulders? Yeah, I'm gonna do your shoulders. What? Damn! I don't like it. I didn't see it. I turned around. I didn't even see it. Damn! I don't like right, it. So, so we gonna we gonna start getting a little okay, still a little a little harder for you. Alright? So we gonna go pal pal. So let's start off with this one. This is a little more precise. We'll start off with this one. Alright? So when we start getting to the wood, that's when you start increasing the impact for it. Like a win. So that's the one that supposedly takes souls from agony. <laughs> there you go. So give him some work, cause he's been talking shit. Right, right, right. We're about to build up now. This all right. Right. give me some work. Right. He's been just... talking shit. Right. <laughs> Robbie's been waiting for this his whole fucking life. <laughs> Robbie's literally been waiting. There you go. Just oh, see if we get my ass. Oh, what? I was waiting for this. You know, you're supposed to get four of them. Oh, you're supposed to get four. You only got two, you're supposed to get four of them. You only got two. Robbie, he's my best friend since yeah. like forever. He's been <laughs> waiting to see me. Who? No one gives a fuck about me being your friend. I'm just saying. First time we see it. This young is slow motion. Hard. Oh! We're gonna throw it in. We'll keep going. Let's go to. Uh, yeah. 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 I just got the footage back. I got that flood. Okay. We go on. We go so these? Mm -hmm. All right. So, oh, well, you're going to make him fill it. You're going to give him one or two, but you're going to make him fill it, okay? okay. Mm -hmm. All right, so. You should get four of these. It's actually not that bad. Because you got jeans on. This is not that bad. Oh, no. because I got jeans on. Yeah. All right. We ready? Fuck it. Alright. <laughs> so I said fuck it, right? Like, I, thought it, one, I thought it was gonna be. No, no, one, one. no you do it, sir. You think I do it, sir? Remember, that I think you're a great person. Okay. And, you know, a lot of things you do are great in life. Come I, on, I don't let's... think you should do this that great, though. Okay. I think you should mail this one in. Like a flip, a flip, a well, little bit. You do what you think you should do. As, <laughs> that was an easy one. That was the easy one. Right. Let's, let's, let's step What the up. fuck is that, a baseball bat? Yeah. I got a sledgehammer. Yeah, she does say he has a sledgehammer. So, <sighs> I'm going to say the last for her to go. But this will give you a nice salad thump. And we'll do four. No, he ain't. <laughs> He's he watching you. We're going to do, do, do two. One on each side so we know what the left and the right feel like, you know. Is this the worst one? No. The worst one, she, she, she bells you out on it. Yeah, yeah. She definitely bells you out on the worst one. 
you just assume the fit position so much that this might be a regular thing for you now. Stop! But <laughs> now I'm just, I'm used to it. Like, you just want to get used to the thing. Like, you know, when somebody just fucking hits you the. It really is like hitting a baseball bat. No, he only get two because I got two. I like him. Okay. Nice person. Yeah, so, nice we, person. Listen, so we gonna end. Let's end it. What are you doing that show? At the or you can. Y'all get um, electrocuted. Let's do this. Let's do this. Oh, we gotta get electrocuted. Let's, 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 let's do this on the back. Let's go. Let's let's do this. Let's do like one. Okay. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, gonna do I'm like gonna one. On the back. And then you do the same thing. So you let it flow. You flog it on the back. So give me ten. Because I'm only taking like four. <laughs> That's not fair. That's bad, yo. That's bad. That's bad. That's things. So let him take if he wants to on his chest. He wants to on his back. Oh yeah, you can have it on your chest. So give him whatever it is, give him ten flows with it. Give no, what? Each? Ten. You're going over what she or got. Five and five. Just give him back. Okay. He's doing that. He's saying I'll put paper. Yeah. There you go. Put some up. Ain't shit. He got you. Don't. Ooh. See? Now you see how I be feeling. See? I take all stinky stuff yeah. out. This is something you're into, though. Yeah, but I don't like staying. Mm-hmm. Okay. Uh, now you want to have to give him the actual. The actual. All right, the actual, actual one. I did an actual one. Now we'll do electric after that. This will be the last impact that I'll do. You're gonna do what? Huh? Okay. Come on. Yeah, I'll do one go. One. I'm gonna, walk, I'm gonna do one big one. Oh huh? But uh, but so, my butt is cold. Warm it up. No, shouldn't have said that. Everything that's over. I'm gonna warm it up and then I'm gonna go ahead, okay? Do you see my butt ripple? Why do you always pick that one? You have, you have, you must not. Right, we'll <laughs> oh my god. So, How about we go between these two? That one is, is more intense than a ripple. Know. So whatever. How does that actually, well I'm gonna find out. Yeah, second you definitely gonna find out, so you can tell. This is the tickle one. Yeah, this is, this is the one. This is the one that you introduce people to electro with. It only looks good on the camera. People see it in the night, yeah. in the dark, because it's lighting up. But this is this is how I can tell if you'll be able to take any take any electric. Because if you can't do this, then there's nothing. Is, you can't do anything. Does it feel good? On, I'm guessing it feels good on the nipples. Yeah, is that what's about to happen? No, I have nipple burns. Yeah. Huh. I have nipple burns, so I don't. You can just stand right here. You ain't got to burn. I just feel like I always have to be like, hey. <laughs> <laughs> My first reaction was hey. It feels like it's burning almost. It's like it's it'll, like, it'll burn your hair off of your body. You know, oh, oh you my know, Luckily, I just shit, I just shrunk my chest there. My girl's not happy with it, but. Do the nipple. I want to see what happens nipple. <laughs> the nipple is the worst place to do that. What is wrong with this bull? Bro? Like, you know, he's crazy. He's crazy. Like, okay? Yo, he's fucking crazy. <laughs> because. <laughs> yes. You want to try anything else on your nipple, it's definitely not going to feel like this. <laughs> <laughs> so I just want you to. Right. Why? What's what's gonna happen now? Well, he's gonna switch it now. With the what? To the flogger. The flogger? The electric flogger? Mm hmm So my titties about to be electrically flogged? Well, yeah, we can do that. Is that what's gonna happen? Uh, you really don't wanna, don't wanna. I don't wanna do a lot of things though, but I've been here. Yeah. Also, I don't want. You ain't gonna fuck. I know, I gotta. Ooh! It's like a little jelly. <laughs> it's like a jellyfish. Don't use it to plug. <laughs> That's crazy. 
Do it on my head, do it on my head. No! Do it on my head. No, yo. that's not safe, yo. That's not safe. That's not safe. That's not safe. Just, just do it on my head. Do like a car wash on my head. If, if, car wash when my people head. see this, they're gonna, they're gonna be like, Harley did Electro on his head. I asked for it. Yeah, I gave permission. Do it on my head. I can do it off camera. I will not do that on okay. camera. Yeah, I have to be. I thought she was tough. Yeah, but I no, like I gotta be safe yeah, about this. Safe. This is a real electro current. Like, not to say I haven't had electro done in my scalp and things. I have, but I, that's a silicone piece, that's and that's I can't tell you that. Is this a, is this just the most hardcore electric thing? One of no, one no. of two. We want on your nipple. I mean, we we've been going there, huh? <laughs> do my arm first. <laughs> do my nipple. <laughs> Do it all! Do it all! Let's go! Yo! Dude, you gotta feel it. Fuck! Come on! Come on, give me your arm! Fuck no! Just your arm! Just your arm! Just your arm! If somebody holds the camera, you can do it to me. Okay. Yes! Hold the cam. <laughs> it's as easy to point, just keep Behind it. Behind the scenes. Oh, shit. Uh, Chris. Get the headphones, get the headphones. <laughs> Alright. Ah! Fuck! <laughs> get the nipple, get the nipple! Ah! Let's keep going. Oh, <laughs> Jesus Christ, Let's keep going. It's crazy. Oh, what was that? Is it cold? This is like the cold, the other one. But it's more intense? It was, yeah. He said he liked it too much. <gasps> there was electric, yeah, you saw you me like it. If you can see it, if you don't move and let it get it closer, you'll be able to see it. Did you get, get up close? Here, one second, let me get prepared. You were ready to go. Alright, I'm gonna try your nipple. You gotta get up close to the nipple. You gotta get up close to the nipple. If I'm doing it, go left nipple this time. You're right, go right nipple. Gonna... You've been favoring Ready? the white one. You better get us on camera if I'm doing my nipple. <laughs> Is there any other toy you want to show off to my nipples? <laughs> Do mine still uh, hurts, bro? <laughs> yeah. I never take my shirt off. Like, I don't even take my shirt off in a pool. What is that? Is that this gonna... is a pinwheel. Okay, this probably feels good. Try on your arm first. That's not bad. It's not bad. Yeah, it's not bad. And apply some, can apply some pressure. This actually feels like a back scratch almost. I feel good. I feel like I should have said I'm that. Try on your arm. That kind of hurts a little bit. Cause I put a little pressure on it, but yeah, we do it the whole life. Who's that? This seems like a single one. Dentistry tools. Yeah, and you use all this shit. Yeah, I had a whole bunch of these. Do yeah, I use this like, like, do you use this every time during sex? No, I don't. I don't use this during sex. No, I don't use this shit during sex. This shit stay in the car. He uses this orange juice during sex. I can't fuck the real way I be trying to fuck and use this shit. I'm, listen, that's the over. Oh, right. I'll leave a piece of water on the bed. Yeah, I got time. Alright, let's get to the last one. Then we'll close it out. Then we'll get back into the interview room because my body's uh, crazy. What do you want to do? I'm going to do this one. I'm going to go. Go back in. Nah, this one right here is really intense. Let's do this one. This one's probably stronger than that. Okay. Ooh, this looks like a little back stretcher. Yeah. Are you going to go back with it? The noise that comes off of it, can they I, hear it? I didn't touch you yet. <laughs> it felt like a bee sting. <gasps> Dude, you gotta feel it on your arm. No! Why? It's just a little bee sting. We got that Come on. shit coming out, man. You should have me at the other one. I can turn it down. No, I'm good. You wanna try to pass it? You do what I do. Alright. If I do it like on myself? Like, <laughs> no, let her do it. Yeah, let me Stop do it. Stop now. <laughs> Why? I I I I'll do it to myself. Why do you have to do it to yourself? I'll do it to myself. Why? No, that's not I good. will do it to myself. I don't want you to do it to yourself. It's no fun. He's you saying you're not good enough. Just give me your arm. I will, yes, I, I will do it myself. You're saying I'm subpar? I can do it myself. Are you saying that I'm subpar? <laughs> Is this myself. masturbation for you? I can do it myself. Would you like to play with yourself? I will. I'm pleasant. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, you guys have any more cool toys you want to use no, before we get back in there? That's it. That's it? I got a slit eye. Alright, hold on. I got a clip. 
We'll go back in there and close the eyes. Wait, hold on, let me see your back real quick. Oh, yeah. Hold on, let me see your back and all its glory. Is it red? Uh, yeah, fuck yeah, it's red. Is it really red? <laughs> yeah, yeah, let me, dude, your shoulder right yeah, shoulder. here. <laughs> I kind of want to show my butt, but I, I don't think I can. I don't want to allow I want to, I feel like there's like some really heavy things going on in there. <laughs> I got marks on my back and my butt, apparently. I don't think I'm that drunk, but I might be too drunk to feel it. <laughs> Who knows? So is there anything you guys would like to promote? And if there is, there's a camera right in front of your faces that you can look in there and promote what you would like to promote. Oh, world peace. Um, what, spring water. No. Fuck Russia. Fuck Go Ukraine. Fuck Russia. Listen, pizza and porn. Um, always got to promote pizza and porn. That is every Thursday soon to be doing it last Fridays. Um, so pizza and porn is, is that's my, my, my baby when it comes to my personal uh, display of my skills. Um, and the bush, the bush is home base. The bush is where everything we do starts at when it comes to Philly. You know what I mean? We have all types of events going on at the bush. Anything you are interested in kink wise, we can provide it for you at the bush. You can Where is the you. bush? The bush is in West Philly, um, 60th and, and Walnut. 60th and Walnut. Um, all that information for the bush, everything I do at the bush is always on my website, um, which you can find on my uh, Instagram because most people are on Instagram. So it's Sir underscore Lises. Um, that's my Instagram page. But the bush, yeah, and, and pizza the, and porn. The bush's website is. Don't beat around the bush .com. and everything that the bush provides along with the toys, the events, the classes um, you can find on the website. Is this a strip club or is this strictly uh, it's a sex toy store? OK, and then there's like a back room kind of thing. Um, no, no, just the whole area the is whole meant store. to be event space, just an event space. The whole area is an event space. And we have brought the fuckery and the kink shenanigans heavy to the bush you don't use the word fuckery like because i feel like this is literally it definitely is fuckery. fuckery it definitely is fuckery so it's okay to bring if you're interested in kink this is a great starting place for you to come to um you can come date with a date you can come solo um, a lot of women come alone a lot of guys come not a lot of guys come alone i want to get more guys to come out because listen fellas the my ladies, guy friends come alone hold on have you have a sex party where it's not a, a sausage fest no, it's, it's mostly women. It's mostly women. I'm not single. And if you're single, why the fuck aren't you there yet? Listen, and, and, and the crazy thing is, gentlemen, these ladies want you to spice it up in a the bedroom. They want you to step out of what society deems to be normal. Explore a little bit. Spank a little butt. Choke a little. Choke a little. Pull a little hair. Learn um, how to choke first. Learn how to choke first. Accentuate your experience in the bedroom. I promise you. Because if she's with me and then she goes to you, she's looking for that exit to come back. I can promise you that. <laughs> Unless, like, it's for love. Because I've listened. Love is just not my situation. Right <laughs> it is just not my situation. Hey, if you right need now. love, come to me. Okay. <laughs> I'll read your poetry. He will love you I'll play with you. No, I already have a girl to read poetry to. I'm sorry. Yeah. Damn it. I, I got to keep. You can come love with me. <laughs> <laughs> and then what? <laughs> Harley Sequin. Um, yes. Um, and my Instagram is Ms. MZ underscore Harley underscore C. Um, and my link tree is on there. I also run the only POC munch in the Philadelphia area. Uh, munch is like a meet and greet for newbies or seasoned people in the kink. We host it every last Saturday, every fourth Saturday of the month. Fourth Saturday. And they got um, chicken wings. And yes, we do provide chicken wings and fries. <laughs> it's free to get in. It's pay your own tab. It's right at Borden Hunting Park at Club 151, a.k.a. Delgado's. Um, you can find us, our like page at Philly Black Munch. Um, just a like page on Facebook, which will keep you up to date with events and anything else that we're doing. Um, anything else I do, you find it on Instagram, but I also do the kink education part of pizza and porn. So I'm there every Thursdays also. I'm just there for the Bud Light. See, you guys do all these things that, <laughs> that go away, like wings, pizza and beer. Like that would be detrimental to my sex life. How about whips and waffles? Ooh. Now, waffles seem a little lighter, a little fluffier. <laughs> Whips a little, a little bit of spice with the sweet kind of thing. That's that's bet. That's Kettles a good brunch idea. Titties and tacos. Do we still have tacos Tuesday? See tacos Kettles would be detrimental again. Paddles and pancakes. 
That's okay. That's okay. See, pancakes are a little lighter. My tummy can handle that. Chicken. I got a sensitive tummy. How if you don't notice this, chicken now. and choking, choking the chicken, choking the chicken's there. Um, <laughs> it has to be chicken. baked though, because if we're frying Baked's chicken, my belly's gonna be upset. Nah, 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 nah. How about air fry? That boobs that could be good. And brunch. Boobs and brunch. There you go. Brunchy boobs. Yes. Bloodies and boobs. About, Bloody marriage and boobs. How about clams and clits? <laughs> Mimosas and munchies. Mimosas yes. and munchies. <laughs> Okay, so I, <laughs> oh. apples and anal. <laughs> Ooh, have you ever seen a girl put an apple in her ass and then eat it? I've seen a girl put a piece of fruit in her ass that wasn't an apple. I've seen the stripper suck all the water out the water bottle and then make a waterfall a and waterfall? smoke a blunt with her cooch. Yeah, I don't like to see that. Yeah. I don't like to see blunts being smoked in coochies. It's not a thing for me. I, mean, I don't even know so, why I was watching. It's a, it's a hard note for it. me. It's a, it, that's going to be a hard pass. The waterfall hard, was amazing. Hard pass. The waterfall was amazing. It's a hard pass. But listen, I can also, I can be booked privately. I can come to your baby shower, your bar mitzvah, your, <laughs> your bachelorette the party. divorce party. Your divorce. I do a lot of divorce parties. Oh my. Like, I, it happens. I, I lived in Vegas, bro. Birthdays. Holy shit. I was like, I was early 20s when I lived in Vegas. You can't believe the women that would come out there for divor- divorce yeah, parties. Yeah, oh divorce my parties God! Amazing. Listen, thing. breakup parties. Listen, even if you need to to, to to introduce yourself back to being a hoe, you can book me, and I'll start you off right. But you can book me through the bush. All booking to go through the bush. You can the bush. What's the bush website again? Don't beat around the bush. Don't beat around the bush. I, just to put it out there, I don't like bushes. So if you ever come to me, <laughs> make sure it's shaved completely gone. But for the sake of, you know, the entity that we, you know, support, we're going to say bush. But it should be. If you between waxes, it's okay. He be all right. I don't like in between waxes. Come to me when your wax is Bald intact. Bald eagle. <laughs> Have your wax intact. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I want to thank Sir Lesus and Ms. Harley C. Quinn again for coming on. And uh, Theo was here at one point. Uh, thank you for teaching me what my nipples do and do not do and the electricity <laughs> that goes around them. I had a fucking great time learning about my, my own body. You, you guys are like sex scientists. Yes. <laughs> Push your limits, bro. Push it to the limit. Thank you for watching that video on YouTube. Remember to like and subscribe to this video. Share it with your friends. Follow us at Loving Them One on Instagram and go to the lovingthemwhat.com. New full episodes every Tuesday, highlights throughout the week, and previews on Sundays, full audio every Monday. What he said. <laughs> <laughs>